Hey, what's up, you guys? This is Ray the Gamer here. Welcome back to another stream. So we're playing some more Microsoft Fight Summer 2020 here. Today, everybody, we have got the long-awaited Concord. We have got the Pepsi livery today. So today, everybody, we are doing a flyout in the Concord with our host, Brett Plays, who is not currently here. Anyway, so the flight plan for today is to fly the Concord from Orly Airport in Paris to Gatwick, London, Dublin, Orlando and Sweden and then back to Paris that is the flight for today should take about two and a half hours in this plane because this thing will go pretty damn fast we got chunk over there in a MiG-31 we had Chuck in a Concord but he's in the he's in the North Europe server we got pro limitless in there he just loaded in I can't see pro though and now we have Das Auto who is zooming around in a plane that I don't have right brett is not here currently and then we have rev who's also not who's loading in right now but anyways i'm gonna mute the guys so they can talk all right uh chuck what server are you on All right, I don't see you. Yeah. So good day to everybody. So we got uh, Chuck, Chunk, Dre, Max, Rev, and Sean. So I'm just going to um, taxi out, and I forgot to turn the weather off again, so I left it on live weather. All but right. I will turn off this rain because, well, if nothing else, the live weather also downloads more data yeah. as you're flying. Uh, and when you're trying to stream as well. Hey, Chunk. And when you're doing Mark II, that'll, that'll you know, be a problem. Hey, Rev. Hey, Chunk. Hey, Alva. Hey, Stancy. Welcome to the stream, everybody. Welcome to the stream, everyone. Luke watching. I don't know. Luke is uh, meant to be coming in in... He's not in the chat. Yeah, I'm going to go with F us on 300. I think. Okay. Now, the biggest drama we found 15 minutes. No. 15 minutes before uh, the stream started, found out that there's now two versions of the Concord that are separate to each other. So, some people have got the version 2, I've got version 1, and there's a very high possibility. We won't, uh, we won't see. be able to see each yeah, other. Yeah, that's at least unfortunate. Uh, There's going to be at least three of these. Look, it's just the way it is. Uh, what's happening with my. It yes, is what it is. Your, Brett, your voice is. Your voice is uh, a little bit choppy. In Discord or in the video? Discord. So say we're loading in. In Paris, right? Okay. Uh, I don't, Chuck. I, Chuck. I don't see you. What, Chuck? What? My stream started. Uh, Chuck. What version of the Concord are you in? Because I just see you as a prop plane. It says it's three minutes in, but it has stopped there a little bit. Alright, there's a generic that's going to try and fly right over me. Oh, no, he's doing a go around, I guess. Alright, I see everyone over there. Hey, I, Brett, I see you. I see you, Brett. You sound like I've got a bit of an internet issue at the moment. Brett, I can see you. Okay, cool. That is... Awesome. Yeah, stream is buffering for me too. What's going on? Wow, you're on the totally uh, other end of the uh, you're on the other end of the airport. Stream is disconnected. Can you please reconnect? What's happened to my internet? Yeah, uh, Brett, I can see you internet. even though we have a different version of the Concord. I can see you. So can that's you good. See my Concord? Yeah, I see you. You're at the you're at runway twenty four, so I'm gonna I'm gonna come over there. I am yep. 
Yeah, so I'm gonna just slew okay. over. Okay, so also has, uh, uh, not the usual fire drop. Can't wait for this internet to settle down. I don't know what's going on there. I'm, I'm kind of worried that it... Yeah, look, it's still buffering. I'm back, sorry. Are you kidding me? Alright. Pain. Alright. That's me so weird, I see you in a CRJ. <laughs> I don't see a rev. Oh, that's why I don't yeah. see you. For me, you're in a CRJ 700, and I'm in front of you. All right, I'm gonna try and park behind Wait, everyone. You're in a CRJ 700 too. What's happening today? I'm in the Concord. It shows up as a CRJ no, like 700 United. Like down. What might do? Isn't it uh, behave? So I'm confusion. All right, I'm my chat is blowing up today. I might, I might end up having to jump to a mobile phone data. You know what? I'm gonna stream too. Cool. Ooh. I, don't, I did already a, did a long haul. Uh, that didn't go Mobile so data. All right. This is not working. My internet's Give doing good so far. Guys, been a while. Yes, mate. Stancy Sebastian uh, says. Is it not? This is funny. Stancy Sebastian says, "When I saw the title, I thought it was a cargo Concord carrying Pepsi." <laughs> Actually, could be a good uh, way to advertise. Yeah, we should get some. Me and Brett should try and get some sort of sponsorship with uh, Pepsi for this okay. for product placement. <laughs> yeah, my chat's I'm not gonna actually oh, ask them if they want to do it. I will let them. That's fine. All right, Dash Auto is in the double off. Okay, yeah, no, I don't see him. Here if I turn on. All right. I don't have so the two and forty-four. Oh yeah, we are. Uh, yeah, we're not practicing. Uh, uh, oh man, my nose no, is my nose is right on your wing, Brett. Uh, my nose is right on your wing. <laughs> Hello, Captain Matty. No, I'm not sponsored by Pepsi, Stancy. Dad. Okay, so now only fire is in a CRJ. Do you just see us all as CRJs, uh, Rev? Uh, well, not pro. Uh, uh, it's not chunk. Okay, well now all of is a prop. Your internet is cutting out, Brett. Yeah. Okay, well now, now that's all that's slowing. There goes Brett. Yeah, where'd Brett just go? All right, he went to switch his, yeah, he went to switch his internet. Dre, do you know Assetto Corsa? Yes, I know that game. I, I haven't played it though, but Brett does some of that stuff, so I'll go check out Brett's channel. Okay, Brett is back. Um, Captain Maddie, hello, hello, Captain Maddie. All right. PS is a bit. Just lock it, Rev. What I'm just doing to get better FPS, I'm just locking everything in at 20, so that way it doesn't jump all over the place because 20 is just about playable. Well, I mean, it's just like around 30 and 21. He's just gonna have a French update. Yeah, I'm gonna go try that. Hey, he's back. Yay. Okay. Been great for day. Chunk, are you streaming BMG tomorrow? Yes, I am, Chunk. Okay, Reb's taking off already. No, I'm not. I'm just going for the proper runway. Okay. Oh. It's gonna be a slippery takeoff today. You're on live, Weber? Yeah. Oh. Alright, I've changed the broken clouds for myself. I you seem to Dre. have a Concord uh, from Dre poked in the nose. <laughs> uh, my back soon is still catching up. Alright, I'm on yep. few clouds, so I shouldn't have any problems with FPS today. To it's not too cloudy.
What is uh, Luke in? I don't, I don't see Luke. For some reason, my internet is sending between one and middle down. Okay, maybe it's caught catching up, but it's meant to be a smooth 2.5 the whole time, but it keeps popping out at 4.7. So whatever it was, uh, I'm wondering if part of that's to do with Microsoft Flight Sim, not uh, my stream. But uh, hopefully now we should be good. Uh, I have changed the internet. That's um, a bit of a, a hiccup. Uh, I'll uh, update you in a minute. If I have a chance. All right, cool. All right. Who's in front? Pro, Luke, mate. Uh, you're not in channel, so uh, I'm just going to get going. I posted right. my um, stream in uh, the, right, your oops, YouTube I'm video bumping my... Okay, well, now apparently version 2 has better dial, so I'm interested in that. I converted a game up to rush. Okay, I do have park brake on. Alright, I'm rolling. Alright, I'm gonna come too. Okay, hey, I blank says looking good. Alright, good. Okay, so we're gonna be a bit delayed now. Rebel, you you better get going, mate. <laughs> There's a chunk coming. Yeah, too bad. I'm in here. Yeah. Chuck so already much. took off somehow behind me. Uh, he's in a, like a Mark IV plane, so. Oh, yeah. Good luck with that. Well, I just got a tuple off to try to uh, overtake me. We'll have no Russians trying to overtake me, thank you. All right, but I rotated earlier than him. All right, Pepsi is up. Okay, very cool. And we want a right bank. Thank you. All right, you gear is going up. To get up to about 20,000 feet because we're going to Gatwick. We're not actually going uh, very far. All right, I might also bring that window up. Thank you. Okay. How about I just acknowledge your frequency change and then ignore you? <laughs> okay, cool. Um, can I just zoom away from the ATC and then just let them back? We are meant to be heading 327. 327. I am making my way through the clouds. I don't know how you guys are going. But I'm at 455 knots. I'm at 303. I'm climbing I'm quite steep. Push the nose down on uh, trim. And just bring this up to about. Oh, if I can get below 10,000 vertical speed, that would be nice. Right, I'm gonna keep it on 100% for now. All right, yeah, I'll keep her at 100. Now, also, you know what? It might be time to just to back off a fraction. Down to 80%. Still doing the climb. Just past 12,000. All right. Hit that lead, sit there, thank you, 79, 80%, alright, cool, we are still nose up and down, thank you, wow, you guys are way ahead of me, alright, this thing climbs really well, I'm hoping you guys in the uh, F-15s and Eurofighters keep up well, alright, uh, it just caught up now, how's the um, flying been? Yeah, pretty cool. I actually went flying with uh, Kiwi Mace today. Alright, you know what? I might pick a... Uh... Oh, I've mixed the... Uh... Brett, are you on the flight path or you're a little no. bit off of it? I'm over to the left of it, but I am almost on the right uh, degree, so I'm just going to trim What's... this out. Alright, um, what altitude are we like setting at? I did this flight already for the first um, stage, and I got to 30,000, and then I really had to fly, um, descend very quickly. So, I may sit at around 25, but I just passed 25. Okay, hang on. Um, maybe we'll sit on 30 anyway. And Brad, what's tomorrow's fly out again? We're no fly yeah, we're doing a beam. BNG. Yep. Ah. Uh. Yeah, it's going to be fun. Hi, Alder. 
All right. Autopilot. Let's see if we can get an autopilot to actually sit at 30,000. Thank you. All right, 30,000 feet. All right, I'll send my AP for my autopilot for that. Oh, I didn't like that. Hang on. Then see, Okay, I definitely got a little too high there. All right. <clears throat> Thank you for subscribing. Five A. All right, I just said Mark One. Leo Singh, welcome, mate. Okay, so we didn't. Well, we 100% did not sit around the. Uh, uh, 30,000 so yeah I just shot 35 I'm shooting up for like 36 with my autopilot okay yep. yeah yeah autopilot was uh, climbing too much so I'm gonna see if I can get this to just sit at oh, it's a, autopilot is still climbing yeah there is a problem with this Let's turn that off you almost got to get it level and then engage autopilot. okay hmm. Okay, so that seems to smooth it out. Now, still going to climb? Or can I just send back down to 35? Right here? I'm at like 42. Well, oh, you can probably... What speed are we going to do? Yeah, because I, uh, I can go max 1,300. Right, well, I'm just passing 1,100 now. Okay. Now. You do, can you, like, max out at 300? 5A, boring episode. Ah, oh, mate. Wait till I crash it, then it won't be boring. <laughs> we are taking the Concord for a flight. We've just passed 40,000. Now my autopilot decides, all right, I'll take you back to 35. All right, I'm so gonna slow. Gonna You're way of, too uh, far ahead of me, so I gotta slow. Oh, mate, where are you? Uh, I was behind oh, you. I kind, I was doing like 800 and just accelerating slowly. Right. You just catch up. You'll be right. So we're going to go to Gatwick, and then from Gatwick we're going to Dublin, and then from Dublin we are going to... I don't remember, where are we going? Uh... What's the name of that place in Sweden? Arlanda. Where's Jerry? Arlanda, yes. Jerry's usually Jerry. here. No, he may be at work. Oh. Well, on a Saturday right, afternoon? Passing... 1300. Oh no, it's only Saturday afternoon, isn't it? He does night shift. Oh. <coughs> Alright, we've got another Concorde over there. Alright. I went racing past me. I just hit 1000 knots. You're probably at like 1500 by now. No, 1317. Okay, I should be able to catch Climbing. up to you then. What are you at right now? 1333 and climbing. Okay, I'm at 40, so... Thank you, Elba, for subscribing. Now, does that pop up on the screen? Yes, it does. Cool. Right, now, I have added a few extra things into my... Uh, All right, thank you, Stancy. GIF files. So, if we go exclamation... Is it item? I wonder if that's what it is. It should bring up a list. No. Items of plural. I don't know. I'm trying to get back to you guys because my game crashed. Brett, right. do you think I'll you can? All right, I want to actually see what that you new gif is. Slow down, are you? There we go. List of uh, list of current redeemable items. I have a new list on a new bunch of stuff. What we should do is. Who's redeemed cough? I didn't cough. Who wrote that? I'll stream less put on it. Okay, cool. So, uh, if we were to put in redeem cough, this is if I cough on the uh, stream, you'll get this popping up. Hopefully this will actually work. Somebody's put on the flyby already. Yeah, I want to see what these gifts are. So I'm just watching Here your stream. There we go. So, 
chunk got in first with a flyby. My uh, cough didn't trip. actually get uh, on there. Did I not spell it right? What happened there? All right, we're crossing the channel right now. We ain't too far from uh, Breton now. Yeah, I'm contemplating changing this weather because uh, you know what? Real weather's cool and all, but uh, we can't see what's going on down there. So uh, I reckon we ought to start descending now. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We should. All right, I'm gonna go clear side. So I'm doing 14, 17 knots, and we. Uh, I'm doing like 14.50 right now. Wow. Yeah, we 100% got to get down. All right, I'm gonna just lay back and slowly drop out of here. So yeah, I can't hear the thing coming on the screen now. It'll show up for you guys in a moment. So yes, these are a bunch of things that I have put on here today. All this right. One's cool. That's Brett, do you um, think uh, do you think you can hop on my stream, or your internet can't handle that right now? No, I'm on mobile phone internet now. All right. Uh, what's our airport? E G K K. Kilo Golf, Kilo Kilo. Yep. It's my second nearest airport to me. Or international one. Gatwick, thank you. I'm actually going to ask for a runway for this time and full stop landing. Thank you. Hmm. Everybody pop your ears because we're going down. Oh, oh, yeah. How fast are you dropping? Uh, 46,000 feet per minute. 27,000 feet per minute. Um, how about if I told you I can go 100,000 feet per minute? Okay, yeah, so uh, p attention passengers, if you had some baggage in the back of the plane, can now be picked up at the front of the plane. <laughs> Absolutely. All right, 26 left. I am not going to stop. So that's the airport I want on the uh, left of me there. Yeah. Also, don't forget, so if your seat's been repainted brown, you're I'm paying for it. I'm still doing... <laughs> <laughs> still doing 1,100 knots. I'm and doing... That's the runway I want right there. Okay. So, I'm going to try not to fly over London and absolutely kill my graphics card. No. But we are going to uh, do a full-on uh, loop circle and line this up onto 26. Try and level reduce... Yeah, traffic. because I'm shooting. Usually... I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm, there's no way I'm going to... Knowledge, gonna... thank you. Yeah, I'm not going to make... I'm not going to make Gatwick at this rate. Oh, yeah, yeah, I did copy. I pressed it. Copy. Thank you. All right, I'm at Mach oh, one right now. Good. My graphics are my. I'm getting terrible FPS. Oh, I'm I'm still at 800 knots. I'm at 600 right now. I'm about to zoom past all of you. All right, let's take some flaps. Uh, cool. Flaps don't work. Just put your nose down. So and you wouldn't do it under uh, uh, over Mark one. Oh. All right, what have we got? Thank you, subscribing WMKI ground. Does the Concord actually have flaps? No. So what happens is when you put your flaps down, the nose, the uh, window goes down first, and then the nose. Oh. Which means you can see the runway. I can't. On fly a or Chuck, are you on uh, Gatwick? Did you land? Good, because that's about where I saw it. Thank you for subscribing. WMKI you should have at least 100 points there because you get that for subscribing. You also get five points for every uh, five minutes you're in my channel and five points for every chat, I believe. But I don't know whether it's... Uh, you can't just go one, two, three. It doesn't add it like that. I think it's every minute or every... I'm not sure how often. There's a timeout on that. All right, so 500 knots. We are slowing down. It's been a very wide circle. Oh yeah, this thing is hard to turn. I'm lining this up for 26 left. 26 left. Okay, thank you. Oh man, this is like a huge, like 50 mile circle. In. All right, I'm gonna All try right. and land a Gatwick and pretend like I know what I'm doing. 
You know, I'm looking forward to the uh, DC Designs uh, Concord when he brings it out and I actually have full working uh, interior. That would be cool. I mean, admittedly, I do have like gauges and stuff, and I think my trim is way down, isn't it? Yes, it is. Okay, uh, that's why I was uh, suffering there. Still descending. I will take down the window. Thank you. But here's the thing. I didn't get why they had to remove Did interior um, clickable switches because people would still buy them if, because like the other ones would still be in progress of being made. People uh, would still get them whoa, when then the I new ones were out. It'd be better. Up. I have mucked it up. Uh, I will slow it down with the natural air brakes as they go down. Thank you. Sorry for subscribing uh, yet. I want to get more points as I'll you know, on your stream. Uh, you sh you Sorry for subscribing again. I want to get more points. Uh, I don't know if it happens that way. If you're already subscribing and then you're subscribing again, I don't know. Did it work? No. It doesn't work. I only see a Piper. <laughs> no, I mean, I'm only subscribing. So. Okay. Right, so, on you. 26 left. What are we doing? Okay, thank you. Let's take that trim back up. Uh, to to 41 knots. And this is where we become a paper plane and start rocking back and forth. That I'm at good though. I'm at like 360 knots right now. All right, we're getting a bit closer. I'm actually gonna have to keep this speed up here. We're descending too much. Cover your ears, everyone. I'm gonna be do a really fast flyby. Oh. And there he goes. <laughs> right, the landing don't, gear down and the nose down. It almost it does have a um, effect. All right, this is gonna be a 200 knot landing. We'll 200 knots. Flight. That's a bit We're slow for the Concorde. Any slower, yes, I drop out of the sky. So nose is down. Oh, I don't think I can do those pretty views. Oh, it's going to be hard. Oh, yay for suspension. We've got some reverses here, thank you. All right. Holy smiley, that was a little bit rough. I might want to change, <laughs> change a few tyres there. Change oh, the stops. Don't stop. Thank you. All right. Turn next taxiway. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a quick photo here just to get everybody together. Uh, it's me. In 1996, they flew this at night from Orly in Paris, which is where we just took off, to Gatwick, where they took it very quickly into a, uh, a warehouse. And uh, basically they had uh, Claudia Schiffer, uh, Brooke Shields, and Andre Agassi, which are all some of the world's biggest stars at the time, uh, and on the Pepsi payroll, I guess. Uh, do a photo shoot and sponsorship um, drive and and whatever else they did. So uh, the next morning. So what we'll do is we'll go uh, request to Gates. Thank you. Okay, well, my plan's on. Oh, all right. I'm gonna have a short final here. All right, I'm gonna have a short final here. WMKI ground says Toyota Cross. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, did I miss something? Let me get to a run real quick. Thank you for subscribing, Charles Vids. Welcome. How is Chunk just floating in the air up there? Or are you on the ground and it's just not sink? It's All right, taxing to gate 108 at Gatwick is where we're going, everybody. 108. All right, I'm coming in with a short final. Stop there. Let's right, get that off the screen. Thank you. 
All right, we need to speed this up a bit. All right. Oh, and my internet's already starting to whine. Yeah, I'm starting right, to have internet. coming in. That's cool. I'll be able to see him landing now. I'm pointing the right way. A bit uh, too high. Empire, we're actually going back behind there. You might want to do a 180. I'm invisible. Uh, get me on that Pepsi payroll. <laughs> <laughs> it costs. It costs, I think, five hundred and sixty odd million dollars uh, to Air France. Uh, to get this painted and do the whole sponsorship thing. All right, Dre the game is bringing in his Concord. See if I can turn this around. I'll do it right, nice and close. Oh. Can't see any landing gear, but I'm sure he's got them down. Oh, that was rough. That yeah, was yeah. That's, that. uh, that's about the same as me. <laughs> can you uh, fly fighter jets? Yes, I can. Uh, if you want to come and join me, uh, you can actually come and bring a fighter jet with you. Tonight's flight, though, I'm taking the Concord. Uh, anybody else can come in at fighter jets. Uh, but we have done a lot of streams with those fighter jets. Last week was French fighter jets. Week before that, we did the Russian fighter jets. Yeah, I looked at my um, my membership, and I think I got about eight Russian names on there just in the last week. People must have been... Oh, did they just say well, that? one of them must be well. Started. One of them might be mine. No, I'm joking. Um, okay, where are you? I I don't see you. Where? All right. I'm oh, you're over there. Zero eight. All right, I'm coming over there. Okay. All right, so I'm not actually going to shut down here. Um, let me just catch up with some of these comments. Uh, Om Prasad, I don't know what you're saying there. Uh, if somebody like uh, one of my moderators can check what language and then I'll be able to um, work out. Japanese ride, Toyota Corolla. Okay. As you can see, there's also an F-15 parked in next to me here. Oh, you're all right and back. Yeah. A, that's, wow, that actually gets a gate. The uh, little French whatever. So once okay, we get Dre over here to gate 108. Come over and join me. We'll take a photo and then we're going to move on. All right. Charles Vid's tough plane to fly the Concord. Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's very problematic. This is an FSX uh, convert. So what we've got, um, let's get back down. So I've got the old dials from FSX. Obviously, when uh, when DC Designs brings out his that is native for 2020, that's what I'll be jumping on that. So I think that'll be a lot more fun to just fly around. Um, I've already done a world tour in this. Uh, now these gauges all come over from yeah. FSX, so if you bring it in and the windshield uh, comes over not clear, so you've got to clear it. I have videos on my channel how to fix that. Yeah. That being said though, I do have access to autopilot. I can set the altitude but it's very finicky. You can't just shove autopilot on when you're climbing at, at massive uh, climb rate. Yeah, it's the same for me. I had the same All problem. Right, you want to just park there, Dre? Yeah. Pull it up, and I'll get a picture from up here. Being crashed. And I might actually take the drone out and do that. Oh, you got just a fraction too close. All right, I'll back up then. All right, publicity stunt. All right, that should be good. All right. <laughs> the MiG 31s are coming in. All right, take a photo, thank you. That'll end up on my Discord later. Sweet. All right. Oh, no, no, because my game. Brett, now we go to Dublin. Right. Brett, so I noticed that the Concord is actually, from when I previously flew, it's actually quite hard to land. It's quite hard to do a smooth landing in the Concord. Yeah, you've got to come in a fairly shallow, um, try not to uh, bump that tail. Um, it even has a little tail wheel I just noticed. Yeah, it's got a it's got a tail wheel for uh, miss, miss out on the tail stripes. I think that song's for Toyota Corolla advertisement in Venezuela. Oh, is it? It's actually uh, Venta Venta Testanda from uh, Jesse Gallagher. But you know what? I think it's time to move on to something else. What I wouldn't mind is actually some rock music. So. Let's put this in. All right. How did you? Oh, you just did the reverses. Yeah. 
I'm just freaking peeling out of here. Alright, you get one of these guys out of the way as well. So if you want to take your MiG 31 Firefox from the Clint Eastwood uh, movie out of the way, that would be good. Reverses off. Love how it's got reverses. All right, we're going over to Dublin. So on the, oh, you know what I might do? I might just show you guys where this uh, where this flight I'm actually taking it from. I think I'm going to end up with an F-15 in the side of my plane. 26 right. I'm getting 26 right for takeoff. All right. I'll yeah, I that. think that's what I took as well. Oh, okay, no, 26 no. left. All right. All right. You go in the air when you're ready. Okay. Because I'm thinking I'm going to need all of this runway just to get up here. Yeah. So I'm Sounds going for it. So, oh, this is like almost a drag I'm race. Bending it. Oh yeah, it's a petty <laughs> drag race. Right, I guess maybe if I want to see what happens. I think we're right, right at the same speed here. That's yeah. Awesome. What's take off? And lift off. My we nose is off. up, and I'm up. All right, what happened? All right, oh, gear no, up. Okay. Gear up, thank you. All right, new yeah, heading will be. Oh, I'm not on the right. Uh... Oh, oh, fine. Thank you. All right, new heading to Dublin is uh, three zero six four hundred eighteen. All kilometers. right. That's not very far. But then they did a tour, so uh, you know what? I'll get the website up for you guys, and I'll show you what I'm talking about. So. Uh -huh. Well, Chunk just zoomed past us. Better get some altitude here. All right, what are we sitting out here? Twenty k. Ah, look, I reckon ten. All I reckon right, we do a low, low level. All right, Mark one at ten. Okay, I'm just. We're gonna just blow out a ton already. of people. We're gonna blow out a lot of people's right, windows. Eighty percent. I'm at 80% throttle. I'm going to trim down already. Otherwise, it's going to blow through here. Okay, so bookmarks for Pepsi Tour. Okay. I'm going to show you a website while I'm flying here. So this is the Pepsi Blue Concorde 1996 uh, story about where they went. And this is where I'm taking a lot of this from. So the promotional flights, phase one, was from ORY to London Gatwick, and then they did a fly around London. And then they went from London to Dublin, which is what we're doing now. And then we're going from Dublin to Stockholm. That's the name of it. All right, cool. And then from Stockholm, we'll head back to Paris, but we're going to Charles de Gaulle. All right. Uh, so what's uh, next week's Concord flight? Next week's Concorde flight will be from Charles de Gaulle again, or is it Orly? Hang on, let's have a look. Uh, they go back to, no, we go to Beirut. From Charles de Gaulle to Beirut, and then from Beirut to Dubai, Dubai to Jeddah, and then Cairo. And then I might fly from Cairo to Milan, Madrid, Madrid, back to Paris on the third flight. All right. So that's kind of where I'm taking this from. Suzuki Bandits, hi, Trey. Hey, Suzuki, welcome to the stream. Oh. Uh, 5A, mate. A bit hard to keep you awake. Oh, message got deleted. What happened there? Uh, too many... Uh... Nine likes. Come on, guys. Let's go for ten All likes. Right. Let's go for ten likes, everybody. A few, few too many... Um... What else do we call this? The uh, emotions. Em emojis. 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 That's just work out why. Just didn't work out what that is. All right. Can you get me back to 15,000? I've already blasted through 10. Yeah, I'm at, I'm sitting at 15. I'm doing 1,600. All right. 1,600 knots? Yep. Okay, see ya. I'm too busy reading uh, the <laughs> webpage there. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Spamming uh, symbols automatically gets your um, thing blocked. So put in just a couple. If you're really that bored, put in, say, three, and you'll be right. Because um, Streamlabs will normally just uh, 
delete them. So. Yeah, it doesn't like it when you use certain language to it. Freaks out about that. All right, I gotta put Somebody my. Somebody forgot to put his window up. All right, window is up. Thank you. As we pass thirteen hundred odd knots, we'll probably go a lot faster at fifteen thousand feet. I got 1,800 knots because I want to get that fast because I'm going to go to the shops and get something. All right. All right, I'm going to try and sit at 15,000 feet. Seventeen hundred knots. Wow, well, right. but I'm descending. Five A. Roger, mate. Boring plane. Well, you know what? Come back for another stream if you want to, or um, chance. Still at the you, Concorde. You're not real aviation. Fan. Are you streaming? No, not today. Chunk, you're kind of Chunk, you're kind of quiet today. Rev, are you streaming? I can't mute. Oh. Told you. Yeah, Rev, no, Rev streaming. I'm streaming. Uh, is Das Auto streaming? As well. I was yeah. thinking is just find somebody who's not in a. Uh, I switched board. to work because watch I their, uh, their, their stream. Wow, yeah, we're definitely hitting at 1500 at the moment. I'm at. Like, Alright. Yeah, I'm way ahead of you guys. Fly an F-35. Yeah, not at the moment, I won't. But I, um, on my channel, I do have a few streams of flying the F-35. Okay, I'm getting a little bit unstable here. I'm going to actually back off to 70% lever and bring my speed back below 1,500 knots. Because at this altitude, besides uh, getting handed off between London Centre and now Manchester Centre, we're AI so far. AI oh yeah, they're, they're looking after it. Well, All right, we're going over when. Wales now, aren't we? Yep. Yep. Oh no. All right, I'm shove on uh, where we're Hello, at nice. here. Oh great! Now it's shot me up past 1500. Actually, said that I was going past 1500 too. Alright, that'll give or, you a I mean, idea 15, where 000. we are headed. I said if I can uh, go for you, Flat out. So I've slowed, stabled now, 1528 Ooh, knots. Yes, mate, I am on autopilot. Uh, I'm actually going to be using this uh, autopilot for level flight. And then when we um, come in for landing, I take over. So, 1500 knots. I'm at 70% throttle. Okay, in your Concorde, you got version 2, do you? Yep. Yeah. 2.5. 2.5. Okay. Oh, I could see you. Four. Yeah. 2.4, is it? Yeah, that's that's cruising speed. Um, does your fuel go down? Let me check, actually. You're way too fast. Uh, yes, it does. I'm at 28%. Did you fill up at the last airport? Nope. I'll need to at Dublin, okay, though. Okay, so version 2. All right. Or an F-18 and F-15. Uh, 5A, mate. No, not today. Um, today uh, is Concorde Day. Uh, but if you want to see a uh, fly in one of those, you can go and check out some of my streams that already have those. Or uh, you can... Um, wait for another stream where I actually use a, a fighter jet. Turtles are cool. How are you able to get a converter Concorde uh, that is a bit functional? Um, it is an FSX version, so you can see that the interior dials, even though they do work, um, are dated. They are FSX uh, flat. Um, but you can convert uh, FSX aircraft, which is what my channel seems to be mostly about. And yes, 5A, I do have F-18s and F-15s. Um, now I've got a bunch of F-16s. Alright, where's Mugger going? Am I going in the wrong flight path? No, I'm 308. What am I supposed to be on? 306. Okay, well, I'm going to miss it by a couple of degrees by the looks of it. But, uh... It might give me a chance to actually get in. So we're about to hit the coastline here. 
Lyre Cessna 208. I've done that. I flew halfway across the world. It took eight months. I flew from Australia to London, and look at this. The plane has actually frozen. Did you wow. London to Australia back? Over the US, oh, no. That would take forever. Yeah. Okay, I have just entered the Irish like, Sea. Rev is ahead of me. I think I leave because sorry guys, we are too fast. <laughs> too fast? Yeah. You don't have something that yeah. does 1500? Uh, Where are you man, anyway? It's... No, it's a little bit bored to play fast, so. Oh, so I just... fast and straight. That's. Oh, okay. Just have fun now. Alright, fair you. enough. Yeah, she isn't that fun. I can't actually see you in, in game in any way anyway, can you? <sighs> no, I left already. Concord is an okay. awesome. Oh, you left later already. Alright, mm. later. Let's go and have a look inside. Stuff, what? How much Pepsi do you think is inside a uh, oh, man. Concord? I don't know, maybe a couple days supply for me. None, it's empty. Uh, 10 likes, thank you everybody for 10 likes. 7 viewers, All let's right. go. 7 viewers, let's go. Alright, we got our air hostess at the back. <laughs> oh, I, no, I already noticed straight. that. And up to the, whoop, up to the, uh... I've got 7 viewers. 7 viewers, but no one's chatting. Rev, are you on my stream or you're not on it? Uh, yeah, I'm on it. Alright. People on my stream are not. Uh, yeah, sure, I'll actually go to your stream. Too boring, ah, oh, mate. Okay, oh, whoa, I am coming into Dublin already. I didn't even notice that. Wow. And yeah, I, I went over the Irish Sea in like two minutes. Yeah. I'm kind of thinking I might need to slow down. Yeah, you'll need to. The only planes I don't need me are some some turn. sevens. So, autopilot is already off. Okay, cool. Slow the doubling because I crashed. Oh, you know what I need? Rev, you're coming in so fast on your stream. Rev, if you're in the con Rev, if you're in the Concord, why can't I see you though? Because I'm in V1. I'm on the version one one. Well, Brett's five also minutes. Brett also okay. has the all oh, right. Yeah, you have the different one. You gotta settle yeah. down, Hi. five A, mate. Um, hey, chunk. Be here watching. You know. Um, I also see my double nap watching. But probably, it's really nice. if you're finding this boring, it's probably not the uh, stream for you. I mean, uh, I'm out. I'm off doing some. Uh, I I don't. How could you get bored doing something like this in a plane like this with so much dialogue going on? How could you get bored? Exactly. I don't know. They want me to play DCS, I guess, or War Thunder. Mm. Right? Can you make a, Can you down. get a clean glass mod for this for me? Yes, it is in the uh, aircraft fix channel. Okay. Wait. Wait. Well, it's probably gonna be really far back. You didn't I send you the files? No, I sent it to Dre, didn't I? That's for the Yak 130. Alright, I'm gonna do no, a bi I'm gonna do a big right. loop into okay, Dublin. Contact Dublin approach, thank you. It's still doing a thousand knots. What uh what runway did you get? That's what I wouldn't mind finding out. I didn't contact them yet. My oh, ATC okay. actually doesn't even work. It thinks the electrical systems are off. So Press control E, turn them back on. I replaced the, uh, um, I'm sorry. Uh, well, well, we climbed there when I reached for a Pepsi. Okay, right, yep, there Pepsi, they are. everybody, we're doing the Pepsi stream. I'm doing a Pepsi drink. There we go. <laughs> Pepsi Blue. So, Apparently 1996 yeah. is when they changed their cans from red to blue. Did everybody know that? No. I wasn't even alive in 96. It's been the scam okay. version of Coke. Nearest airport list. Let's see. That is my opinion. Okay, what's our airport code here? Echo India. Okay, yep. EIDW. Alright. 
right ahead of me here, but I'm going to have to go around because I'm still, still doing 700 knots. All right, 11 miles, Yankees land. Uh, looks like we got Jerry here already. He's been waiting for us. Fly straight. Hey, Probably Jerry. Walk down the road. <laughs> 28. Okay. I'll bring that window down. Thank you. So, Brett, All why right. do I install the Concord FSX.MDL file? In the model folder. Okay, Pro's just come through on a SR-71, I believe. Okay, there's no way I'm landing at... Uh, at 500 knots, so yeah, I'm going to go, yeah, uh, to make a big loop too. Loop. That's what I'm doing. What runway did they give me? I was given 28 left. 28 left. I'm saying, all right, good. Yep, three knot wind. That's fine. Almost 1.5 k's. Yeah. Um. How do I pronounce your name? Joe Porter. Yes, mate, I was coming in way too fast, yeah. so, uh, oh, we're loading in Dublin now. Oh, the internet. Just I usually, by Pepsi. I actually usually got pretty good frames over Dublin. I stopped for the moment. All right, what have we got? 440 knots. We'll do a full loop out here. We actually get to see Dublin, it's pretty cool. Wouldn't mind getting that map off the uh, screen again, thank you. Alright, very cool. Whoa, I just went down to 1500 feet there. That was not cool. Alright, I'm on zero uh, engine. And I'm still doing 430 knots. Yeah, same. These planes are awesome. Okay, now I'm going to have to put in some engine. It's very nice here. Let's see if I can get out far enough before the uh, runway, and we'll take some landing gear that'll definitely slow me down. Did I bring that window down already? Yeah, I did. Okay, cool. Thank you. Yep, I can see that white patch there. Right, Sensi, like welcome back. It's all good. Drive the bus. This will be interesting. Oh, mate. I'm too busy mucking around with my stuff there to realize that I'm losing too much altitude. Oh, my trim's down. There we go. Holy schmoly. Okay. Landing number two of the day. Only two more to go. Stockholm and Charles de Gaulle. Wow, we just raced up to 1,800 feet. Lucky there's nothing but Pepsi cans in this. No passengers. Just free Pepsi for Ireland. Alright. This should be hopefully a better landing than uh, Gatwick. I'm going to have to put my nose down. I won't be able to see. Okay, where do we get to? 1600 feet. We've got a Das Auto coming in over the top of us. You still in that triple off Das Auto? No, I just did it to work just to make it easier. Alright. Concord, okay, very good. Oh, no, I'm losing okay, too I much altitude see, here. I can't see Dre at all. I'm way. Oh, yep, I'm <laughs> done for. Low your nose, Captain. Yes. Jerry just made it. I was at work doing a stop take. I said, uh, oh, no. Joined Dublin. Yeah, yeah, you did. What yeah. is wrong with this plane? Why is it trying to Mugga. drop out? Whoa, Mugga? We got Mugga in here? It's been a while since I've seen him. Yeah. Nose is down. Thank you. We're lining this up quite nicely, although I'm now going off while I'm too busy trying to read chat and look for everything. I've lost Ray. Can't see his Concorde. I'm um, you're directly name. ahead of me, but all right. What That's the right. hell is it's wrong with this thing? All right, we're down to 209 knots now. Is it my trim that's oh, messed up, or look long enough? And so, other one is longer. Okay, so. Well, there are reverses on this. 
So, oh, we're going to come in quite steep here. And oh, yeah, there's Nuke just in time for... Oh, man. Again, way too hard. All right, will the F-14 get off the runway in time? No. <laughs> <laughs> we just scooped up an F-14. Holy schmoly. All <laughs> right, can we get a butter? Let's see if we can get a butter here. All right, I'm still on reversal, thank you. Oh, man, I can't believe I'm not dropping out of the sky. I'm doing like 150 here. Yeah, that's what I should be getting down to, 150. Oh, that was rough. I can't see you. I've lost you. Okay. Well, we've lost the second Pepsi Concorde, but I think we gained another one. Alright, I see Chuck. Chuck, what are you in? Oh. I just see you as a jet of some sort. Alright, All I'm right. following Brett. Another Pepsi. All right, photo op. Um, I haven't contacted the ground to find out where we need to go. Just taxi around Amosy and pretend like you know what you're doing. That's what I do. Parking, and then we'll go from parking to fly out the next one. Hopefully, it'll actually shove us over here next to the uh, SR-71. That looks pretty cool. Got a. Uh, Stingray Zoe. Delta Echoes over there. I don't think they're flying with us. Here comes Das Autos. You can see another Concorde come in. Oh, yeah. That, that was, was wrong. nice. Yeah, that was better than me. Better than me. Yeah, I think I landed even worse here than I did at Gatwick. It's quite hard to fly this plane. Right. Parking over the back. Um... <clears throat> a bit ironic, I could see yours, but I couldn't see uh, Chuck's. A Concorde. And you got version 2, and I've got version 1, I yeah. believe. I, unless I downloaded two. But either way, I couldn't see the other one. Alright, we're going over to parking. This actually looks like a gate to me. Somebody popped in a constellation on the uh, airport here. You reckon we could beat that bus? The race, mate. <laughs> Alright, what's Pro in? Uh, pro's in a prop plane. He, he, he beat me. No, Pro's in the SR-71. Yeah, he he must have the FSX when I have a... Uh, I, have an, I, have an S, I, I have an SR-71, but it's pre-converted. Very good. We're in Dublin. Hey, Jerry. Pro's changed for a different plane, or he's inside, oh no, he's changed, there we go. Alright, <clears throat> park brake on, thank you. Chunks Hello. just drove in. <laughs> we can't stop, use the building. Oh, it's a race to Stockholm in an SR-71 or a Concorde. The SR-71's going to win. Or a MiG-31 Firefox that Chunk is stuck in the ground with. Alright, do we have another Concorde? We've got Das Auto. Yes, we do. You want to park yourself in behind? Because I, I can't see Dre at all. Maybe I backed up. How do you not see me? No, nah, maybe I... No, no, I can't see your name. I haven't been able to see your land or anything. So maybe what we need you to do is drop out of uh, West USA. All right, yeah, I'll, I'll swap. Well, I can see everybody else. All right, East. Uh, we'll, we'll wait one moment, and we'll see if we can see the third Concorde that's meant to be here. East and right now to be right West. In the middle of another plane. Jerry's in something small and propellerish. All right, I clicked oh, West. I'm waiting yeah. for everyone to load in. Right, version two didn't seem to work um being able to see but uh so i'm guessing all right i that you 
or Das Auto. Wait, why can't I see yours? I can see theirs. There we go, Dre's view. Das Auto's view. Alright, quick photo op for Pepsi. Thank you, that'll end up on the uh, Discord. Alright. <coughs> and I am going to move on, so I'm going to keep these going because we're one hour in and we've got two more flights to go. Yeah. The next ones are actually the longest flight. So. I reckon it might be, this might be a four hour stream. Arlanda, 1623 kilometers. I mean, 1500 back. We, we, all we've done so far is 326 and 484. Let's do 1600 kilometers to miles. That is 900 miles, round that up to like a thousand, so I reckon a little bit less than an hour. It'll take us. Alright, cool. That was back. Welcome back, mate. So yeah, I reckon about another hour and a half left to maybe... So yeah, I shouldn't go more than three hours. Yeah, boss. Oh, he's not even going our way. Go around another Concord. <coughs> Did you uh, get your refueling done? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna call Dave up quick. <laughs> I don't. I'm too lazy to go find the fuel pump, so I'm just gonna have Dave come fill me up. Uh, Alright, good old Dave. Yeah, I will, um... Whoops. What happened there? Old short, runway 28 left. Contact tower when ready. Okay, cool. Where's 28 left? It's over here. We la runway we landed on. Okay. Oh, we're going to hit the grass. Sorry, Dublin. You might have to patch that up a bit. Yeah, doing some, yeah well, I did some off-road in this thing garden. earlier. Chuck, is that F-22 just a little bit slow? Or are you just mucking around in the mountains? Should go fast enough. Are you flying on modern or legacy? I'm gonna go on modern for the Firefox uh, because it's from Flight Sim Squadrons. Yeah, All right, we got a Das Auto on the left. I'll take the right. All right, I'll, I guess I'll go in the middle somehow. I should run back to the front wing at We've got a chunk doing donuts. Uh, he's really ripping up the garden. <laughs> All right, where, where should, are you right. guys at Dublin still? Nose is down, nose you up, are at thank you. All right, I'll put my nose up. All right. Excuse my breathing. All right, we're taking off, I reckon. Chunks in the SR-71, alright. No, wait for me, I'm literally just spawning in. Alright, well, oh, now he's gonna block me. Are you kidding? SR-71 doing circles. Oh, oh, lord, I'm gonna hit him. Yep. Guess there's no I killed mercy. him. <laughs> you guys are somehow getting out, accelerating quicker than I am. I'm just hitting 130 and you guys are already rotating. Oh, right, it's because I got more fuel. I have a full tank now, that's why. Right. Might have some problems rotating. Oh, no, but it should I'm be alright. Right, Bank. Who's eating food on stream? Yep, I can't take right. off. Zero, six, zero. I'm going to have to <clears throat> drop some. I'm going to have to drop some fuel. Out of 50%. Yep. Alright. Jesus. Alright, 41. Quick Overshot the runway by like a mile. Or overran the runway by a mile. No, that's one thing you do in the LA6. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Right. Yes, I'm not joking. 
Yeah, well, that's what happened uh, two weeks ago when we I tried to take off from that short strip. All right, windows coming up. Thank you. Speed is just past 400 knots, and I can see the airspeed down the bottom there. And I'm just going to line right, this up. Alright, all right, guys, I'm catching back up. Okay, very cool. All right, I'm going to have to trim this way down, passing 6,500. I can hear my ATC going for it. What's our cruising altitude for this flight? Uh, does somebody want to pick that? 8,000. 42 it is. I'm not doing 8,000. I don't know how much uh, data that would download trying to bring in... Uh, right, 42,000 it is then. Gonna, I'm going to cover at 8,000 feet. It said 38,000. Oh, 38. I didn't hear the 30 part. Yeah, I just heard the 8. I only heard that as well. Well, either one of those will do. I don't mind. David, Bob, Tenga, sup, Brett? Been long? Been long? Been long time? Alright. 060 is what I'm supposed to be heading. I'm in 062. I will miss it by miles at that rate. Bro, what's your current speed? Uh, 700. Uh, I'm doing 400. Bring it back. To, all right, 80% leave, and then I'll actually get my super cruise started. Uh, I'm also climbing very slowly at the moment, so what I'll do? Pop in. How do you have your engine, uh, Brett? How do you have your engine gauges show up? Because mine didn't show up. Okay. I have actually um, converted this fully. I uh, checked my files and I did do a full convert. Oh. Um, so that's why they're on the outside, but I also have them on the inside. So what do we say? 42. See if my autopilot can actually get me there. I had this thing. I was cruising at like 55,000 on the uh, test flight I did earlier. Yeah, they can do that. Apparently, it used to travel at about 60. That's what someone told me. Wow. I wonder why I was going so low. Because I wasn't sure that it would actually work all right up at 60. Wow, well, I'm climbing too quickly here. I don't think this autopilot's going to get me there. No, autopilot's not on that way. Feels as it feels quite gutless, kind of, right now. Not feeling much engine power. What are you at? What, uh... Oh, you don't have your levers on the outside, do you? No, I'm at... Uh, 20, uh, like... 20 29,000 right now I'm doing about 400 I think I'm just gonna slew over to you okay. uh, who wanted to land on the island no no we happen to fly right over EGNS so that's uh that's the Isle of Man isn't it could be. I think I intercepted Dre here one time. Yeah, you did on um, when I was sliding the little Cessna over here. No, not was it a Cessna? Yeah, and you came in the Yule seventy six. I even made. I, I even have a short of that. I thought, yeah, I'll just go and fly over him. That'll do. All right, we're over the I Irish Sea right I now. Know he has. We're over the Irish Sea right now. We're gonna be over the North Sea pretty soon. All right, I'm at 46,000 feet. I'm going to drop down to 42. Feels really wobbly here. Uh, I'm on 80% throttle, which allows me to get to super cruise. Once I actually get to my altitude, it will actually speed up. So, yeah. Um, 
I don't go 100% because it seems to prevent it from uh, pushing it further. Ah, oh, true airspeed. No, no, my, my airspeed is only 737. What's your true airspeed? 1368. Oh, yeah, I'm only doing 543. But uh, still climbing. Long, long, long time, says Elva. Oh, somebody to put in an icon. Twenty two likes. Thank you very much everybody for those likes. You just wait till there's an official Concord and you know how many Concords will be flying then? <laughs> oh. Come on bro, bring it in nice and close, mate. Bring in that SR seventy one, park it off a wing somewhere, make it do a show off. Or you can fly past me at about three or four hundred knots faster than me <laughs> if you want to. Should do an SR-71 flight as well. We've got to do that up over Russia. How did Dre get in front of me? I slewed. Right, I'm at 1,405 knots now. I'm at like 600 and so doing my super cruise. Do you have your window up? Yeah, my window's up. up. Xbox controller is vibrating away. Okay, we're going across uh, Scotland. That'll be Scotland down there. Oh, excuse me, we'll let out some of that Pepsi. Pepsi, if you want to send me a case uh, to continue drinking on stream, I don't mind. <laughs> Although my wife will, she's like, you've got to stop drinking soft drinks, Brett. Can't lose weight. I want to lose weight. Can't lose weight if you go keep drinking uh, soft drinks. I guess if I did excessive exercise, it'd probably help. Rebel boy, how fast are you going, mate? Hundred knots. Oh. Now, all I heard was a hundred knots. I hope it was a bit more than that. Yeah. <laughs> Eight hundred. Oh. Eight hundred. Okay, I think when your microphone comes on, you must be still muted when you start talking. That's why um, I didn't catch no. the first part. Oh, okay. Probably trying to push the talk on in a minute. Oh, you pushed the oh, talk. Push the talk. Okay. But I usually mute because I like using voice activity. Yeah, okay, cool. So, we're Manchester Centre continuous plans, contact Scottish Centre. Ah, it's correct. Going to contact the Scottish. Contact <laughs> Scotland Centre. Oh, hey, I want to want to smoke eight hundreds. <laughs> Pepsi Concord, and I'm gonna fly over. Break a few windows in the process. <laughs> you got mine, do you? No, not really. The <laughs> window builds will be hard, though. All right, we are. All right, we are. Pepsi Blue. All right, we are approaching the North Sea. All right. My conquer keeps trying to climb. I gotta set my trim down. Forty-two thousand exactly, which is pretty good. All right, I'm gonna show you guys where we're up to. Put that on the screen underneath the camera there. Gives you guys a bit of an idea. So we're past EGCN. If anybody wants to come and join us, get something fast. Yeah. Um, we're going to be heading out over the water to ESSA. If you want to meet us there, you can, because by the time you load into your flight sim and get an aircraft ready, we'll probably be there. I know it's a thousand kilometers, but um, it's only been five minutes since we left Dublin. And then final flight will be from there back to Charles de Gaulle where we're going to get an absolute 
nightmare of uh, frame rates when we try to load in Paris again, but that, that happens. All right, another uh, review of the website that I'm following. So the promotional flights phase one is going to be videos one and two. So we are doing from March 31st of 1996. We did from Paris, O-R-Y, Orly, to London Gatwick. And then we did to Dublin. Now we're doing to Stockholm. From Stockholm, we'll go to Paris. And then in the second flight, I'm going to skip doing that over again, just the same thing again. I'm going to go from Paris to Beirut, Beirut to Dubai, Dubai to Jeddah, Jeddah to Cairo. I'll probably stop at Cairo because a flight from Cairo to Milan and then Madrid and then back to Paris will probably be the third flight. And then what they do is they do it again, which we're not going to do it again. So we'll actually do three flights. But it'll be a quick flight from Charles de Gaulle to Beirut. Pretty much, so that was the 6th of April 1996. We'll do that one on the second stream uh, for this, but uh, we'll probably gun that and go pretty much as fast as possible. Where is Hosted? Wedgie? Who's getting a wedgie? What are you flying, Jerry? Concord? Uh, it was, well, another change. Not are you going to join Long Haul tonight? No, not it was tonight. Long haul, it was just uh, flying a bit funny, yeah. so we'll have to change it into flanker. Right, okay. How fast does that thing go? Well, because we switched the fuel to the dev mode, I'm only up to 400 knots at the minute. So we'll right. Climb. Oh, I lost you. Are you more than 200 nautical miles behind me now? Or it must be, yeah. I can see Chuck. Chuck Longfire, are you still keeping up? Uh, <laughs> that F-22 should go pretty good. I tell you what, if you want a fast plane, that's... um. The F-16 from Flight Sim Squadron does Mark II plus easy. <coughs> Way overpowered. It's not meant to. Do we have a date for the Lancaster flight? No, but how about we do that after this? Oh wait, could it be the start of July? I'm away until then. Yeah, yeah, okay. Might do a flight from London to JFK and the Eurofight after this is done. Timer, because I want to see how fast it can go. Oh, what was it? Uh, oh, Ouija. Ouija. Okay, I'm not sure what Ouija is instead of wedgie. Ouija. Ethan Rashad Patrick, I want to know whenever the Xbox Series S and X versions come out, how are we going to download this summer? Hayware and freeware. I guess you, you know can't. I don't know. Um, I watch a well, lot of Ozfight Sim, and he has a lot of information on Xbox and stuff. Actually, um, but he doesn't say anything about when you can put mods in. I think you'll find it'll be only the stuff you can buy on the shop. I think there might be a way you actually can put mods in. The I know the Xbox on, the on Xbox. Yeah, there's a web browser. I think you could probably put right. native FS20 mods, but not FSX mods. Because I don't think there's a yeah. legacy converter for Xbox, but you could probably put the so, native stuff in. Yeah, like Dre is saying, Ethan, I think what you'll find is uh, you will be able to find mods. Wow, did I just load in something? Did I move my mouse over to... No? Okay, we're here. Um, you can put in your like web browser thing and go and click on a Xbox compatible modded file but you won't be able to do the same as this so this being an FSX conversion and a lot of the stuff I've got is FSX conversions um, and I bet that's part of why uh, we can't click buttons anymore because MDL files are not supported 
and it probably is also because they want to bring it out on the Xbox. Yeah. But no. Here's Dash Auto. Oh, you were right there. Rob, right what are you in now? But then you disappeared. Your father. Oh. Oh, I didn't know you had Twitter, Rev. I don't know yet. Uh, yeah, I do. I've uh, settled at 450 knots. I'm at 42 flat right now. Yeah, 42 flat? Yep. 1450 knots. 1530. Chunk and I don't have the best ping to each other, I think. He's uh, shaking all over the place. I mean, I'm... Probably because in that SR-71, he's trying to go as slow as possible. <laughs> <laughs> he's doing half speed, 1,500 knots. Shaking back and forth. i got Jerry behind me again. I can definitely see him. Phase off my front right. Pro Limitless is... He's gone for it. He's, he's done it. Uh, oh, why didn't someone tell me my, uh, my plane was off? Off the line. All right, I'm going to go uh, bank back to zero six. You know what? I'll do zero six one so I can get myself back online. Been bad in London recently. Sorry, say that again. Mm, Sounds brain a bit like you know, just since it's May, the weather's starting to get really bad in London. Oh, Ooh. real life. Not, not sim wise, yeah, real life. Yeah, like yeah, okay. thunderstorms every now and then. It's starting to become storm season, and I absolutely love storm season. Right, okay. I know it's a bit out of subject, but I just had to. Yeah, yeah, no, weather's cool. Um, I'm on clear skies on this one. Uh, Ethan says, wow, well, thanks for the info. Let's hope for the best. Yes, mate. Sorry, my stream's probably a few minutes behind at the moment. Uh, because I had to swap to a mobile phone data to stream this uh, because my home internet just said, nah, mate, I'm, I'm not giving it to you tonight, uh, right when it started. So, I don't know what happened in here. Only way for mods to be installed is if they did what Bethesda do and implement their own mod application in the game. Or they cav could have USB support for it. Do you know what? If it works on a PC, yeah, you could just take it from a PC and put it on your Xbox and it would go in there, you would think. His plane is off the line now, he tells me. That's all I was gunning it. Uh, Jerry, what are you in? Uh, flank. The what? SU-30. Oh. Oh, 27. Are oh, you not in the SU-30? Yeah, Luke, we're not on the line. I'm not. Brett is. I'm not on the line, and Brett's I, even far far off of it than I am. I, I just finished saying I was off the line. Why didn't someone tell me? So he goes, "Your plane is off the line." That's all right. I do the same for other people too. Thank you for subscribing, Ethan. Welcome, mate. Welcome. All right. Looking at my line, I'm going to need that zero six two. We're already coming over the land. I just hit my mic boot. Right, we yeah, took right off now. about. All right, we took off about 20 minutes ago, so I reckon we probably got another 25 minutes to Stockholm. All right, cool. What I want to show everybody is this is new to me. I've got a new microphone and uh, boom arm. So finally, instead of having the little thing that sat up here in in the little uh, winding plug that just basically sat on the end of there, and my voice was projected. Uh, a long way away. I now have this a microphone and I can get in the deep and a deep voice and do the full voiceover. Hello and welcome to another Brett Plays video. <laughs> so, uh, nah. now the guys in Discord can probably tell the difference because I used to have my microphone on the headset. This is also a new headset and this microphone was not even as good as my last microphone uh, one. But I got up one time to walk back and um, took my corded headset with me and it shattered on the concrete floor that I'm on. Uh, 
All right, well, it looks like the SR-71s have gone for a faster fly there. All right, it looks like, no, Pro's actually bringing it back around. All right, I'm getting a handoff. Where am I getting a handoff to? Bobo Centre. Continue as planned. Okay, cool. Thank you. Hello, Bobo Centre. All right, we cannot zoom out any further. So we are coming over the uh, coast. Oh, you know what? I might end up hitting that coastline. See, I got myself into this uh, edge. I'm not sure. Mate, you having trouble with that SR-71? That's right, I'm just having fun. Yeah, right in front of the camera, that was cool. Alright, let's put that back. If you're interested in uh, coming and joining and or like either flying with us or having a chat, if you're going to come and uh, chat with me, excuse me, um, in my Discord, Make sure your language is clean, because this does get uh, streamed. Uh, if not, I'd have to remove you or silence you. Um, but other than that, look, we're on West USA. Get something fast. Something very fast. So we are currently doing 1,451 knots. Just on cruise. What I might do is I might actually start uh, descending. Does anybody have the airport um, markers on and tell how far away we are? Uh, no, I do not. I think that would be a good idea to have on this one. But uh, I'm going to take mine down to 20,000. I'll let my autopilot do it. So what I'm using is a uh, toggle on my uh, throttle that I have set to lift the um, uh, altitude uh, 100 feet above or below. So I've got a toggle that goes up and a toggle that goes yeah, down. Yeah, same. Uh, Hossa says, I think Sobo would want to keep Xbox version mod free uh, as it's easy to install payware aircraft for free. Yeah, I would uh, not be surprised with that because then they have a controlled system. When I say controlled, it's controlled by what goes on there means it's going to be stable. They don't have a controlled system with PC because everybody's got a different idea of what they should have on their PC or what video card or what video card they can actually get their hands on, really. Alright, quick reminder for those who are recently coming, we are following this promotional flight. We're currently doing the eight, uh, 4th of April, 1996, Dublin to Stockholm. So this is part of the uh, tour. Uh, there you go, look, 500 million US dollars they spent on this project. Alright, yeah, I reckon I'll start to send in a little bit. So, Dublin, Stockholm, and then we'll go to Stockholm back to Charles de Gaulle. So, what was that? I can see that. Yep. <coughs> I am descending, but I'm on autopilot descent. So yeah, I'm same. At, uh, 1900. Uh, mine's taking uh, me down at two. Minute. Mine's taking me down at 2000. Yeah, mine's sitting at 1995. Oh, there we go, 2000. Yeah, mine's oh, doing so the same. The land. Oh. I'm still off path, am I? I'm going to have to right. bring this over probably to about 065. Yeah, mine's a bit off as well. Well, you're way ahead of me. No. Wow, yeah, I did not even notice that. I'm at like 1,500 knots now. All right, we'll bring that down. Rate says, hey, hey, Rate. Welcome, mate. We are taking our way to Stockholm from Dublin. 
Uh, if you've only just said hey and you just joined us, welcome. I just showed the website we're following uh, phase one of the uh, 1996 flight of the Pepsi Concorde. Has someone made a Pepsi Max livery? No, and I hope not because I hate that stuff. It uh, leaves a flowery taste in my mouth. I'm not a big fan of uh, Pepsi Max. Oh, he disappeared. Where'd he go? Behind me. How about that, eh? Like he froze all of a sudden. Right, you just disappeared and then you were behind me. But I did get a good shot on that. You'll see that in a moment in the um, video. Let's see if we can get in a little closer. Relax, it's screenshot. There we go. Problem is, if I take a screenshot, I think I will go backwards all of a sudden. There you go. <laughs> All right, good shot though. So apparently they were uh, worried about the dark paint on the um, Concorde being a problem and said that the, they didn't want them flying over Mark 2.2 .2 for, for any longer periods of time, so 20 minutes maximum. Why is that? They also, uh, because of heat, the amount oh. of heat that the paint would cause being dark or something, I don't know. Uh, that's why also why they kept the wings uh, white because the fuel tanks are in the wings. Ooh, we're getting a little bit of uh, loading in something here. They don't look like very big fuel tanks, really. Yeah, they don't. Know, I guess. And it spreads out nice and flat. You hate Max. Damn, I must say it's different being upside down. I don't know. You tell me. I'm on the top of the world here in Tasmania. <laughs> Yeah. Just you guys got all the writing on the maps upside down. <laughs> like who said north is up? I think we actually started to send in a bit early to be honest. Oh, I'm only at thirty one thousand. What are you at? Thirty four. I still think I need to be heading probably zero seven zero. So I'm going to do that because I am way off the line. So I'm almost over ENCO. So this is part of Norway, isn't it? No, we're over Sweden right now. Sweden? There's Norway further up, is it? So E N C O yeah, is Norway. Yeah, yeah, I'm over Norway. Because I'm off flight plan. <laughs> Oops. Wait a minute. So Arlanda Airport. Is that even Stockholm? Sweden's in front of me, yeah. So yeah, okay, yeah, yeah Arlanda yeah. is in Stockholm, so oh. we are going to Sweden, but yeah, yeah after yeah, that. We're going to Sweden. But after that, yeah, right, it's Norway. E N C O is right next to me here, so I'm I'm actually in Norway. Oh, hang on. What are you doing? You're turning back. Why are you turning back? No, no, no. All oh, right. Because I moved my heading. I'm just yeah. not 100 percent sure where. I'm just kind of curious where exactly Norway starts and Sweden ends. Never really was too good at that whole area. At the border. I've seen the upside down map you posted, yes. I was going to say I posted a map. Ah, uh, yeah, that's how it works. So, yeah, we did cruise, we cruised over Norway. And then Norway is like super narrow along top, and then it kind of borders with Russia. But it's, yeah, it's super narrow along the top, and then there's Sweden and Finland. Duncan's redeeming a flyby. Yeah, now there's I get it. Flyby coming. No, no, the people who originally made all the topographic maps and set the time were in the uh, UK. Greenwich Mean Time. That's why they put them in the middle of the, uh, of the time zone. 
and all the maps were put uh, making Europe look bigger than it actually is. Because they made their own country look uh, more important. So that's what they were planning on. Luke says I live in England. Upside down on my screen. Good on you, mate. Alright, Pepsi, I'm out. I'll have some more things. Alright, you think we came down too fast? I'm looking at that airport ahead of me and I oh, like that's not the one I'm going to. I don't right. think I think we came down too early, but not too fast. Two thousand feet's a good rate. Oh, I'm, yeah, yeah, I'm at twenty four thousand at the moment and I'm still gonna <laughs> I'm gonna punch it down to ten thousand by the time I get to E S O E because it takes ages to get down. I'm at like twenty seven now. But I'm gonna have it. Elmo Center. All right, cool. Continue playing, thank you. What up to eighteen hundred knots? You're doing eighteen hundred knots. Me, your first thing with fifteen seventy. Where are you? Eighteen hundred knots? Are you behind me? No, you must be way ahead of me now. Oh yeah, you're chasing down Drake. What's Dre doing over there? I thought I was heading for the airport. I'm at... E -S -S -A or e -S -S -A. E -S -S -A. It looks like I'll fly over ESOK. -okay. Yeah, I might need to bump it just slightly. Uh, hello? We're frozen? Oh, please don't crash. Please don't crash. We are loading in Sweden. Hello, Sweden. That's the problem when you're doing 1,575 knots. Uh, the internet wants to load in so much so quickly. <coughs> Driver the bus, what was Concorde's skin temperature at supersonic speed? Who can guess? Uh, at supersonic speed. Uh, I think it was... A couple of hundred degrees Celsius. Like 220 or 240, maybe 280. No, no, put, put your frying pan in the, uh, put your um, baking pans inside the <laughs> uh, oven at that temperature. You can I don't know exactly how much, but um, drive the bus, give us a heads up. You know, the body used to expand easier longer when the event was on. Wow. For I remember that <coughs> the, uh, the SR-71 would leak on the runway, apparently, because the joints weren't sealed properly, and when it got up to speed, it got so hot that it would expand, sealing up all the... Uh, the joints. It's ridiculous, isn't it? All right, crazy. I'm coming in at 1580. My paint has not peeled off, so we're doing all right at the moment. I'm now up to 2020. 2020? How do you do 2020? Have you souped yours up? No, I'm just in a slight bind. All oh, right, you, you actually. Well, oh, I'm going 700. Uh, feet per minute uh, down. 92 degrees Celsius. Oh, is that all? Is that all? That's still a lot. Maybe it's the SR-71 who did that. Because it was made of, um, was it made of titanium? The SR-71? Right, we're also getting a few bumps and stuff here. Um, my question I posted in the Discord the other day about Streamlabs freezing. I found out it was my PC set HDR for one monitor and it caused a weird freezing glitch. 
Right. So, Streamlab, wait. Your PC set HDR for one monitor. So one monitor only. Who's Trey? Trey, um, how are you? Are catching up to you or something? Uh, Where are you headed? I had to readjust my autopilot, but now it took, put me off course even more, so I'm just going manual now. Okay, ESSA, you heading towards that? Yeah. Okay, Scotland forever. No bagpipes? Oh, there's a no bagpipe sound. Are you a separatist? Um, a what? If you can watch the Scotland forever thing, it's loud, so turn it back down. Okay, yeah, not, not while I'm... Uh, Stream is probably a good idea then. Yes. Hasn't Scotland been trying to get uh, independence for centuries anyway? Yes. My stream has been pretty dead for probably, I reckon, maybe the last hour. Well, more like last 45 minutes has been pretty dead. A bit boring for you, is it? Driver of the bus says yes, titanium. Was the Concorde made out of titanium or was it uh, no only clue. the uh, SR71? I don't know myself. That's that auto is way ahead of us. Okay because I'm in a Roblox. No, no, Roblox. I don't know. I had like seven people in here, but everybody left. But none of them are really talking for some reason, even though I was talking to them. They come, they see, they move on, it happens. Was watching yes, was oh, you're still watching it? There you go. Thanks. Rev's here. Alright, I'm going to slow down here. Jerry, could you hop on my stream? If, if you can. Alright, yeah, I ought, to start, I ought to slow down now. I'm doing 1400. Yeah, just coming back through 1400 now. Pump that back to 2% uh, engines just to keep them on idle. I don't think the engines uh, cowling closes on these or is animated. Whoa, it didn't like me zooming in. Okay. I don't think these cowling things come down the faster or slower we go, but they were set up so that these would actually come down and. Um, slowed down the speed of the air coming into the jet turbine because uh, it can't handle fast speeds. Separatist. Raja Raja. Scotland want it, but always a vote against it. Yeah, didn't they like recently vote in a party with a, a higher share of um, to get out because of Brexit they think that they're going to lose out more um, okay I've already passed so I'm going to take over here thank you autopilot off thank you we'll take control here thank you so fast and why is my loading in. right I'm coming in at about oh, hey Jerry uh, I'm coming in at about 400 knots now at idols Now, what runway did they give miles. me? I'm, I'm going to overtake it. Alright. coming up right now. Runway 26, I was given. What about you? Or you didn't contact them? Runway 26. Yep. That's fine. So, still doing 900 odd knots going forward. And then what I'll do is I'll, I'll do a uh, turn around. So, we need to land down there. Runway 26. Are you kidding? Did you give me the shortest runway? Oh no. They don't look very long runways. But they all look about the same. But this apparently is where uh, it went in as far as I could tell. Where did, the, uh, where did they come from? It came from Russia through uh, multi uh, CIA uh, companies, shelf companies that uh, bought all this titanium. That's where most of the titanium in the world comes from. 
and most of the lithium in the world comes from China. Yeah, it's pretty cool. The car's already heading to Shotgun. Alright, runway 26, yes, off to do a Charles big loop. The next one. That's not all leave, so we don't head okay, back well, to I can't see you all for some reason. Alright, and we're not going to Charles de Gaulle now, we're heading to Stockholm. What about the live weather is here? Do don't get. Never do it. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna have to do a big old loop because 26 is on the other end of the airport. No, going down, thank you. Soviet Union was super secret. The USA did not have. Uh, in the time, yeah, yeah. Like I was saying, all the different uh, shelf companies that bought it. All right, I'm going to need some natural air brakes. Thank you. That'll be landing gear down at 480 knots. I'm hoping those flashing lights over there, where Das Auto is, kind of over top, is my runway. Keep the engines up. I had too much uh, down trim again. Now that I do have landing gear down, we don't need that nose just yet. Down, but we will bring this back around to a line up. Actually, you know what? I think I might need that nose down. Thank you. I love that. Love that animation. So flying a supersonic, we've got to keep the uh, trim uh, facing down. But when we get into a landing mode, I've really got to bring that trim back to the level. Looks like we've got somebody off our wing. <laughs> Oval racing. Yeah. Very cool. All right, you're lining up behind me. All right, I'm gonna do. Right, Dre's, I'm gonna Dre's making a. Uh, a loop around. Okay. Yeah. Jerry's here. Das Auto is bringing it around as well. And we got a tornado with lots of colors on it uh, behind us. Uh, 261. I will probably line it up right and then drop that speed if I can. Now, if I sit back down here, can I see my speed? Ooh, I can. So if I sit down properly and not in the booster seat. Hey, River Boy's on the runway. I think. His name just popped in. There you go. Alright, we've got a nice long runway here at the moment. I am coming to the right. One, aren't I? Just saw uh, something go flicker on my uh, CCTV. In Mac 2 now. You have a CCTV at your house? Yeah, on the shed. I'm just looking out there, but it was, I think it was a moth going in front of it. Oh. Speed around 126. Okay, cool. Thank you. Yeah, I can see down the driveway, down to the house, and inside the shed. And I've got space for another camera. Oh, we're getting beeping. Whoa, that's why. Proximity alert. There's a tornado right in front of my nose. Oh, we're dropping. I think it's that's the problem with this. Yeah, yeah. I was inside looking at it and also staring at the uh, CCTV camera up there. It's a literal tornado. 
Okay, I'm still back at 206 knots. I think I'll land around there because I do find that it's uh, going to be nice and smooth. Is it a tornado plane or is it a tornado, like an actual one? No, no, plane. <laughs> okay. A Navia tornado. I want to see a tornado on Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. I want to do some storm okay, chasing. Actually, I want to do some storm yeah, chasing in Flight Simulator right. when we get some tornadoes or hurricanes this summer. Same. I hope we can get a good work and see one birdie by then. We well, can go to Oklahoma in like oh, the summer. Oh, another drop down is too hard. That is way too hard. Brett, you gotta you gotta practice this. Oh man, I'm getting choppy here. Yeah, when is summer go to Oklahoma and start storm chasing? Someone's series. redeeming cough. Did cough work? Yeah, it did. Whoa, that tornado just did a 360. No, 180. I don't think he had much luck landing there. Uh, for some All right, can we get a butter? Break. See if we can get a butter. Oh, that was a butter, or at Concord least an almost butter. At landing at 18 degrees. Yeah, I think I'm coming in a little. That was a butter. Need to do. That was a butter. I'm find out what my angle of attack meter is in here. Start practicing. Whoa! And a Concord just came Jerry, over don't me. Don't challenge me when it comes to butter. No, but Concords are quite hard to butter. Fighter's gonna come zooming up you in three. Your fighter, that's easy to butter. Again, thank you. I just saw you come in. I didn't really see you though. Land. He's behind you now. Yeah. Alright, acknowledge gate 47H, thank you. I've watched my landing. I've watched my right, um, three landing on my street. Really solid uh, landings here, which is not cool. Alright, let's see if I can do this. Okay, do I have to turn all the way around, or what's the deal with this? Okay, now I'm upside down. Trunk's gonna beat me into the parking spot. No, Dre's gonna beat me into the parking spot. <laughs> Dre, I'm watching my stream because I want you to see my landing. I want to show you what the real oh, meaning of butter is. Oh, we're gonna have to just park it here. That's close enough. I'll get the green square. <laughs> oh, we disappeared. Yeah, I'll get the green square. <coughs> okay. And by parking here, oh no, I've lost Dre altogether. So close. To oh, I'll back out. Oh yeah, okay. Well, that's not going forward. All right. So we, this is our uh, second last destination. So this is Stockholm. Stockholm was a visit. Have a look. I'll wait till I can see all the aircraft before I um. It wasn't that good, but I'll prove it's myself. Eight, in fourth of board. April. So, 4th of <laughs> April, flew, wow, somebody just <laughs> 4th of April, uh, Dublin to Stockholm, Stockholm for a flight, and then, uh, wow, they didn't even stay for more than one day, so 4th of April, I totally didn't did a fly around anyway. Stockholm, so a circle, and then uh, took off and went back to Charles de Gaulle. Alright, this ought to be good, you should be able to get a good screenshot. Physics of this game are confusing me. Okay, let's move that to there, thank you. And we still got our camera thing. Whoa. Camera what secret. is physics? Alright, let's take a photo like that. Thank you. That'll end up on Discord. I'll put all three of these. Uh, there'll be four of them in total. This will be the, the tour. Alright, I'm going to request take off. Uh, taxi the gates. Uh, why do I not have taxiing ground services? I don't think we can get the jetway on this. 
Maybe because the uh, plane is not all the way in. But I haven't finalised the flight, so I need to move on to the next one. So I want to depart just straight out. Thank you. No, nope, can't get there. Okay. So yeah, going to Charles de Gaulle now. We are going to go to Charles de Gaulle now. Uh, back clearance. Thank you. There we go. I had to put the back wheels in. So taxi for departure straight out will be number three. Thank you. I'm here. All right, runway 26. Thank you. This looks good. <laughs> is it? Hold position, caution, other traffic. Arbor is on path, you're way too late there. Alright, continue taxi. Acknowledge. Thank you. You gotta love ATC and uh, knock it off flight to Tim. Yeah. Turn around. <laughs> yeah hey, SR71 is chasing me. Oh, chunk. Mate, can't wait. We'll just go around this little car here. This would give him a shock, wouldn't it? Hello, mate. I left the amateur on accident. You left? The amateur on accident, yes. Going up to 60,000 feet on accident. Right. I'm being serious, I actually did. Didn't realise. Did you actually taxi down the runway to get there first? <laughs> he's trying to. He's, he's going the wrong way, but okay. Oh, we get to see a Concord land in the tree. No, he actually took off. Oh my god. That was quite a short yeah, runway for the Concord. Alright, you, you got to now do a 180 because we're actually going to take off the other way. But you knew that. Oh, yeah, my nose was down. I just noticed that. <laughs> I already have. I think Concord actually do take off with nose down. I thought the nose down was just so the pilots could see. No, you have to be able to see when they're taking off, and then the the uh, pull the, the window up as he gains speed. Oh. Well, it's because the pilots need to see. Did you ever see a Concorde taken off the nose the whole way down? Right, yes. I never so did. still see the ground. Well, I didn't uh, pull up enough there. Alright, I am at 15,000 feet. What's our altitude for this leg? Uh, this is another long one, so... Group snoop. Whatever's put. Uh, what did you say? Go really high. Yeah, All right. Well, someone told me in, in the chat that it was meant to sit around sixty. So let's do it. Sixty. All, All right. right. I'm ready at twenty thousand. So two. should be a problem for me. All right. You turn around yet? Yeah, I turned around. Okay. Yep. Yeah, two, two, two. Where we got ahead? Alright, let's have a look at that window coming up. It's a bit hard to see there from the distance. Just uh, using the trim to stop it from like rocking straight up. I'm at 48% uh, trim down. It's still climbing. Alright, where's my uh, angle of attack here? Uh, ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. I'm on a 25 degree climb. 
Is that right? Hmm. Alright, I'm already at 42,000 feet. Holy schmoly. Yeah, this thing's hauling oh, ass. Alright. Oh, Dallas Auto's not far behind me. You guys are way down below there. I can't see you. I'm uh, above you. My bus is two to four degrees, a bit different from the Concorde, 18 degrees at landing. Right. Whoa, we are pulling up to a much. Right, that's where we've got to go back to 80%, otherwise we flame out. What do you mean by flame out? Feet. What do you mean? Uh, when you're still on afterburner, it loses. Oh. Uh, throttle when you're going maximum. So I just got to bring that back up. It couldn't couldn't get into. I don't know some physics to do with um, the super cruise that is set in this. That uh, it's meant to happen, I think, below afterburner. And I still had afterburner on. When it got to there, it goes, no, nah, not enough. My bus is two to four degrees, a bit different from the Concorde's 18. Yeah, absolutely. What do you fly drive the bus? I'm guessing it's an Airbus. But if it is an Airbus, an Airbus what? It's, uh, so he's like a real life pilot? I don't know. I'm guessing. I think I've uh, seen him chatting on uh, Oz Flight Simmer's chat, but um, I, let's ask him. That's what I'm asking. Uh, it doesn't work. Doesn't hours work? Uh, isn't it? Yeah, it is, but what is it called? Um... Is it top hours, or is it uh, got food going from mod going to mod chat to the? Yep, okay, that's fine. What did we say we're going at? Sixty thousand. Yeah, I'm at fifty three. I'm at fifty four thousand right now. I just googled it and it creates the sixty thousand feet, or in other words, eighteen kilometers. Wow. wow. All right, I'm at fifty four thousand. I'm climbing to two thousand feet per minute, so I should be there pretty soon my current speed whoa, is whoa, whoa. Hang on. 1370 I had my uh, direction set to wrong <coughs> wrong point at least 1000 was my stream Chunk is, I think, trying to go as slow as possible. In his SR-71? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, that's auto's in here with me. I'm still climbing. I'm not actually on autopilot at the moment. I'm 100% manual here. Like, uh, I don't need to trim down as much once I get over the 40, 50,000 mark. I can uh, almost fly level here, which is good. I just think it's because you're going so slow, you don't have to. Well, I'm 1,122 uh, knots true airspeed. I'm actually slowing down. I am climbing. Hours should work there, Luke. Um, once I get this autopilot set, and I'm slightly off the line, so I might just bring it over one more degree. And look at that. Pick autopilot, and it has a hiccup. And I lose altitude. Dre, by the way, I can move the IL 86. No, it's coming back. You can move the IL 86. And I'll be IL 86. I, I don't understand what you're, I can barely hear you. I just want to tell you. 
here I L eighty six. Does the plane have a cockpit? Yes, mate. I'll get back in here. So uh, the window does come up and down, the protective window, and the new nose it does uh, snoot. And the droop snoot. Snoot um, dog. And my my uh, dials are all FSX uh, imported over. Um, you have to have FSX for this to actually work uh, with the dials, but you don't have to have it to make the plane fly. So, uh, but yes, these are working, although I think some of these, uh, I'm not sure if that yellow dial works and moves around, but uh, yeah, these ones do. At the moment, though, we're trying to level out at 60,000 feet. I'm just trying to get it. A 320 skipper. Right, cool. A 320. Monster Arthur says, oh, never mind. Yeah, it is actually a... Um, oh, he's changed his message, did he? No, no. Um, so, yeah, it's an FSX conversion. Uh, not a... Um, and so my stream might also be about 10, 20 seconds a bit behind. Uh, I had to do a quick swap of the internet earlier and it delayed it even further than the about 10 seconds it starts off at. Alright. Slightly off the flight path, but I'm going to put the flight path back on my screen here. Shove it underneath the camera. Alright, so we've just left Stockholm and we're now heading back to Charles de Gaulle. Uh, this is uh, the 4th of April, 1996, actual flight. This is the one we're following, 4th of April, Stockholm. No, this one here, sorry. They did a joy flight around and then they went back to Paris. So we're going back to Charles de Gaulle. Powerhouse. That's one amazing aircraft, mate. It is awesome. And I'm looking forward, I keep saying it, to when it is a native Flight Sim 2020 aircraft. When they bring in the uh, DC Designs model, unless somebody else is doing it, but I'd say DC Designs is probably the first one to get it there. Since they've converted it from their FSX one, but then he's had to do his updates to get it working. So... I am also nose up just a little bit. Is everybody else doing the same? Finding that you're actually going a slightly nose up. Uh, oh, yeah. I'm a little bit nose down. I'm at sitting at 60,000. Nose down. 60,000. Mine's poking up just to keep it up. Where's that? I think I might actually go classical music. I'm going to crank this up. Hopefully you'll be able to hear this. This might actually be quite apt for this. This is uh, the Hall of the Mountain King. Alright, let's get some music in here. That's a loud aircraft though. Yeah, it is. says hello and welcome back Alba mate. Hey Alba. We got a Abelard. Come on. Come on. They're an Abba fan. A B V A. Name Flat. I don't know.
see you coming. I'll move my camera to show you all. Driving like a Russian, all the sinkers get away. Driving like a Russian, if your life is breaking back. Driving like a Russian, turn it loud and feel the bass to get away from the police chase. All right, so the final uh, run from Stockholm to Charles de Gaulle. It was 4th of April 1996. And then it looks like uh, from Paris to Beirut, they did nothing on the 5th of April. The 5th of April 1996, nothing happened. And on the 6th of April, it flew from Charles de Gaulle down to Beirut. So when uh, next weekend, I'm going to do another flight in the Concorde. Maybe we'll do a little bit of... Um, planning getting uh, the version 2 in there and give it a try and it might also mean that I have to refuel. We're going to do a full-on trip to Beirut, Lebanon, and then from Beirut to Dubai. Uh, let's check the fuel actually. Uh-oh. I'm a 10% fuel, guys. Okay. You need an air to air refueler that can go really fast. Yeah. Could someone get a uh, KC-10 up here, up to Mach 2? Look at these guys, they look awesome. G'day, mate. I got a KC-10, but it doesn't come Mach 2. Do you reckon they could have made a B-1 Lancer refueler? A what refueler? Yeah, they, they refueled the B-1 Lancer. So they, like, oh, make the actual... No, you know the B-1 only does, like... Mark 1.1. 1 .1. Apparently, I've been playing a lot of uh, Snow Runner recently. Fun game. I have Mud Runner. Tedious, though. Yeah, I've got uh, spin tires. Played multiplayer on that. It's lots of fun. Look, there's lots of mods. I like the looks of Snow Runner. I've watched some people play it multiplayer. I appear to be loading in something. Where are we flying over? Wow, my camera keeps stopping. We're loading in something, even though we're at 60,000 feet. There we go, that's some decent music too. Drive the bus says cheers, flying tomorrow uh, with a new apprentice. I got to the moon, I guess. Um, yeah. You know, not everybody's born an, an expert, except the latest generation. They, they, they apparently know everything, Wait. And, th and they'll Don't. tell you that. I'm waiting for someone to, uh, to arc up in chat. I think I'm Generation Alpha. What, what is Generation Alpha? Gen I don't know if I've heard that. Gen Z. What's Alpha? Is that like after it's, like generation it's Alright, 
so I want to see what the possible fastest air fuel aircraft is. Alright, does anybody have a KC-135? Yeah. Okay, I can probably slow down to about... Yeah, alright. Uh, see how fast the KC-10 can go. Alright, uh, right, I reckon I could slow down at about 619 miles per hour for the KC-10 to be able to give me a mid-air refuel, so... How fast do you think the KC-10 can go? 619 miles per hour is the top speed. I just looked it up. Mile per hour? Yeah. So what's that in knots? Oh, hell, I reckon that ought to be... Uh, 400 knots? Maybe, I don't know, I'm doing 450 right now, and I'm doing 13-something. Maybe, like... True airspeed? No, my true airspeed is 13, but my airspeed <laughs> indicator says 450. I'll see what 619 is in uh, miles per hour to knots. We've got our classical music going at the moment. 537 okay. knots in true you airspeed. You're not synced anymore. You're not smooth flight. All right, I am at nine percent. So, can you find an airport? Mm. I could try. Well, there well, we is. We did pass Copenhagen. Yeah, we, we already did went past stop at Amsterdam. That's. Yeah, but kind of descending and then having to climb back up here again that would take forever. I think midair. Oh, there's there's Echo oh, Delta X3 Juliet next up. You could descend really quickly to that. <laughs> Oh, I think we're. I think I'm better off doing. I think I'm better off doing a. I think I'm best off doing a mid-air refuel, to be honest. All right, anchor up. We go to Bremen. All right, so. All right, so who's gonna fuel me up? Is Dave gonna come up here in his KC-10, or, or is someone else gonna come? All right, uh, Shauna, can you come fill me up then? All right, I will start slowing down. I will live weather back on. I can't see any of what's going on like there. Like I'm on oh, lock. That's why the internet has mucked up because it's bringing in live weather. Here. Well, that's not very good. I don't like it. There we go. Scattered cloud. That way, it's not actually downloading and trying to bring it in. Problem that it is when you go so fast. Now, why are we only doing 1169 knots? Wish I'd refueled in Stockholm. Ooh, there's my Russian music again. Alright, I'm slow. I used to that when I was in Russia. Okay, let's see what the service ceiling is for the KC-10. KC-10 service ceiling. Alright. Okay, the servi service service ceiling service ceiling is 42,000 feet, so I will descend to 42,000 feet then. Sean, so those want to see what it's like to refuel a Concorde, go and check out Dre the Game is uh, stream. His link is in on my channel under uh, other people I have worked with. I'm gonna get a refill from Shano. Because I'm on 10%. Uh, we, are, we are downloading something. Alright, I'm at 8 now. Alright. All these towns and cities we're flying over. I'm at 14. That's all that you're on a KC 10, right? Yeah. Alright, I'm, I'm coming to you so you can refill me because I'm on. Alright, I'm like gonna put my nose down because I wanna slow down. Can we view the cockpit? Okay, to, yes, mate, we can view the cockpit. Right. We are using an FSX version of this, but we do have uh, the, the dials that came over from FSX. But you have to have uh, the FSX files um, in the default location. If you've moved to another hard drive, they don't actually come over.
and the windows are usually uh, not see-through when you first um, convert it but I do have a video on that how to do that on my um, channel so if you want to uh, check that out you can actually import it it's free but it is an FSX and nothing is clickable but you can see that these do work so um, at the moment except this one the nav uh, and unfortunately none of these light up which is a shame because I do have autopilot on but I don't know what my yaw button is although uh, I don't think we're getting all that much buffering I'm also descending to 40,000 feet why is that? Yeah, Small speeds are any speed to refuel I was not getting enough speed at 60,000 I was only getting 1100 alright Shut out. Let's do forty thousand feet then, since we're all kind of going down there. It just makes sense that I set forty. I love it when I get called a millennial. Sorry, pal. Three years late for that one. I love it when the young ones call older ones boomers, but they don't actually know what a boomer is. Um, I don't know the definition of boomer, but I don't want to say it out loud because I don't want to be offended. Boomer is someone who was born in between nineteen forty-five and nineteen sixty-five. 65 to 80 are X's, and then 80 to 2000 are Millennials, and everyone after 2000 is Gen Z. Except, right. and then there's actually got it right. And then there's some other generation. I think after 2010, but Do I don't you know why they call it Generation Alpha. Which uh, because it was a big old baby boom right after the war. Yeah, yeah. There was a large baby boom. A lot of people, lot of new babies came yeah. along. Yeah. And they were called baby boomers. It's like, you know the phrase Karen? Yeah, I know what a, yeah. Yeah, I know what a yeah, Karen it's is. Like, it's for um, like any sort of woman who's entitled and, yeah, that's... Yes, the it's the female it's entitled person, and yeah, Karen is a common name. No, a Karen can be a guy, too. A Karen can be a man, yeah, too. Yeah, I can. I've seen I male Karens. A, male Karen is a Darren. I thought that was a Chad. Oh, it's a Darren, is it? I thought it was Chad, a Chad is like, I don't know. Oh, no, okay, I, I just flew right over Daswato. It's on. Alright, I am at 50,000 oh, and descending. You keeping up, mate? Okay, I can't oh, stall out. You're on autopilot, so you're kind of having a nap while you're there? <laughs> just a little bit. You know, yeah, that happened to me once. Brain. It happens. Oh, mate, you used to sleep through a lot of your. Stuff uh, happens. Yeah. Dreams. What are you talking about? But on purpose. All right. No, I actually did accidentally fall Raid. asleep on the stream once. Okay. Right, Sean. Yeah. On my head, Sean. On my heading that. is two twelve. Yeah, I did a full shift last night till one o'clock. Ah, uh, yeah. And then I had to go back and walk. Then at eight o'clock this morning. Jerry, what do you do for work? I'm a warehouse supervisor. Oh. Do those warehouses behave themselves? <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, wow. Uh, have you seen any where? Have you seen any uh, have you seen any werewolves there? Uh, yeah, I've seen a few leprechauns. <laughs> leprechauns always hiding. All right, Sean. I'm doing 400 knots, right, so you, you should be, you should be able to catch up to me, no problem. All right. Forty thousand. All right, cool. Brother Bus says I'll ask him if he got the keys. All right, I'm gonna turn off my autopilot. Get them every time. Oh man, this thing is. See you drive the bus, mate. Have a good day tomorrow. Hopefully, it's not too stressful having to teach someone. And when you're jumping in the next stream, let us know uh, how it went. I'm genuinely interested. Also, I'm heading two two one degree. Two two one. All right. Isn't it weird that I get better FPS with photogrammetry. All right. Let's see how my fuel yeah. is. Eight yeah, percent. I run out at five, so I should be good. <coughs> oh, you run out of five, do you? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, I need to get to. Bur I need to land at Bremen right now. Can go for your truck to drive on the runway. Well, Luke Hostad, I am 
I'm actually dry as well, because you're the one said, I am actually a Gen X. The Who's next who, generation who to in inherit alpha? everything. But not entitled necessarily. Yeah, uh, it's not the title. Oh, I'm just gonna launch order, aren't I? No, Isn't it the Gen Y that think they're entitled? Because they got spoiled by Gen X's? Uh, yes. Baby it's Boom is, I think, um, taught X's they need to work for stuff. Uh, well, the X's <coughs> decided they were gonna just what? give the stuff to the Y's, and the Y's are like, why do I have to work? Well, to my understanding from the X's, at least from my experience of the X's, they said, they say kind of work smarter, not harder. Refuse. And this is kind of when a work and life balance appeared was in the X Gen. Millennials okay. are, oh, I'm upset. Okay. I want everyone else to be upset. My emotions are the most important thing in the world generation. And yeah. then there's Z's, me, who are just kind of young. Can't really say much. <laughs> hey, let me tell you something about Alpha. Young. We don't care about anything. Alpha is after Z, is it? The alphas just don't care about anything. Generation Z, as you call it. They do whatever the hell they want. No one cares. Is, is Z a US way of saying the letter Z? Okay. Everything because... Because... Shano, what's don't your speed? Yeah. 310 knots. I'm just flashing. Okay, I should be able to... Oh, you guys... Yeah, I'm, dis yeah, I'm disappointed in America too, these days. The only reason I, I say it because it's A, B, C, X, Y, Z. Z and C sound so similar. Why would you just call it Z? So if I see you, I just turn on already. Z. Z, E, D. Alright, I'm going to head out to get my <laughs> KFC. No. You're heading out and getting KFC. Oh, Don't so you dare eat that on the stream. Oh man, I fancy me. Oh man, I fancy me some KFC now. Um, well, I'm gonna be on me eating it. Um, you know what? I actually had it last night for dinner, so I'm good for another year. Oh, I haven't had KFC in like, I haven't had KFC in like two years. I just realized. I had my grease and oil change last night, and I went there, and there were so many Uber Eats drivers all lined up waiting to get. All right, I'm gonna do a pause break. Ever. Cause I'm coming yeah, in way too fast. I've for like food or Subway and KFC. Nowhere else. And Five Guys. I've never... KFC, Family, Buffet, oh yeah. Oh. You're making me hungry now. What is it, 22 <laughs> a.m.? With, with gravy. Know. With gravy. And beans. What, what? Beans? Alright, I'm gonna try and slow beans, down. Do you do? Oh, in Ireland, do you do? Oh, not in Australia, though. No. Little tubs of beans that so you get the gravy in. Coleslaw? Uh, I think they do coleslaw as well. Yeah, we only have coleslaw or um, the mashed potato and gravy. And all just gravy. Alright, let's try and fuel up. Oh, I Almost lined up with Shano. No mashed potato and gravy? What's it, your it, speed, Shano? It's a really smooth mashed potato. It's like their chips have been mashed up and really smooth. No, no. Bits on them. Shana, what's your and speed? Then, oh, yeah. And then the gravy is put over the top. And when you dunk, nice. dunk your um, nice soft bun that you get in your like a three piece feed on my, on my mouth, almost watering just thinking about it. Um, <laughs> Luke's saying the lost generation 1890 to 1915. Yeah, that'd be about right. I'm doing 558 knots. 558. Alright. Alright, five, five, eight. Alright, I should be able to catch up to you then. The interbellum sure. generation, 1901 to 1913. Sure, they do beans in England as well with KFC, don't yeah. they? Yeah, yeah they do no mashed potato, though. No mashed potato. Oh, man. It's awesome, because you dip your chips into mashed potato with gravy on it. And it's like the smoothest, no, softest mashed potato. Thing ever. No, you, guys you, are, you guys are making me hungry. That was pretty good. Then you get like things like uh, hot and spicy. Oh, do you know the best KFC I've had? 
was the crispy spicy honey. And my mouth was burning. I'm telling you. Crispy I'm honey. Australia, I love going to hog's breath. Literally, it was absolutely burning. Yeah, hog's breath's cool. Um, I, I've kind of gone off that when they decided that they weren't going to um, do the uh, the steak, the cheap steak sandwich. It became like a, a slice of roast beef instead of a steak. Luke saying uh, KFC beans are ace. I've never had beans at KFC. We don't exactly. sell them here. Mm. I'm missing out on such good stuff. Oh yeah. Do you know what? Oh, I haven't had a corn and cob from KFC in a decade, probably. At least. Got hot popcorn chicken, chicken right now. Well, yeah, like right, chicken it's popcorn. No, oh, Luke, you know, like chicken breast and the bone. Oh, oh yeah, around. yeah, they're, they're all different burgers and stuff. <laughs> you guys are making you me hungry. I, I, I'm going to find KFC mashed potato. <laughs> potato and gravy. And I'm going to put it on screen. Oh, God. Oh, Lord. <laughs> the KFC website in. Uh, Tasmania, like what well, the KFC dot what? Well, It'd be dot Australia. No, KFC dot com dot au. Oh, dot au. Right. So okay. KFC dot oe would be the origin. All right. So here we go. This one will do. Here we go. So All right. So over on the screen. So this here. Six percent. I gotta hurry this is up. Is your potato and gravy. So um. And basically, you get your chips and you dip it straight into potato and gravy. So you actually have mashed potato on the end of your chips. <laughs> it's awesome. The way you put them up on stream. Yeah, it'll take a moment. Uh, but beans. I, I've never seen beans. Um, I didn't even know they had beans. Oh, what's that? Chicken nugget style? Yeah, I don't know. Got lots of different sauces as well. Oh, that one's a peanut butter. No, we don't have that here. Oh, my game crashed. Rip. No. It's fine. I probably. When well, I imagine flying back. over Paris. Large potato and gravy, handmade every day. Oh, really? Did they like shove it in the microwave <laughs> every day? No, I'm sure they they make it. They also have twisters, so they're in like um, uh, flatbread. What's that um, stuff that they uh, like a uh, Lebanese bread or um, tortilla? That's it. Yeah, yeah, the soft stuff. All right, right we gotta try and make the. We gotta try. Oh no, there I'm you coming go. in too On fast. The screen now. Have a look at that. That's Shano, crazy. speed up. Give it all you got. Put your gear down or something instead. Oh, yeah. Alright, gear's coming out. It's going to slow me down too much, though. That's the problem. The US. Right, okay. Whoops, I, uh, it does taste bad, I'm telling you. I turned my autopilot off. Alright, we got to hurry this up. I'm at 6%. One more percent of mine, and I'm done for. Okay. Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, speed yeah. up. All right, you guys got to see this. This stuff is rich. You can't beat that gravy, sure. You can't dip your chicken into the gravy. Oh, okay. yeah, love it. Shano, um, can you slow down about 400 knots? You can buy just the gravy, or you could buy um, uh, potato and gravy. But the meals come with potato and gravy. What's your speed now, Shano? It's a must right now. Oh, so potato on potato. Oh, mate, yeah. All potato right. on potato with uh, gravy. Yep, absolutely. It's awesome. Mm. Oh, welcome, mate. Thorgrim. Long time no see. Been a week or two. What's your speed now? I'm going to descend. Uh, I'm doing 1535. No, right? Shano. Uh, true air speed. 480, good. Okay. And descend to 15,000. I'm going to break a few windows in France. 
Oh, we're Fran over France already? Not that I am. Oh, yeah, you're way ahead of me. saying I'm going to LFPG. That's not right. Alright, maintain 480, please. Oh, yeah. Or LFPG, whatever your current speed is. Charles de Gaulle. Right, okay. Uh, I'm, I'm definitely going to have to descend here, because I'm going to slow down as well. We're doing 1,540 knots. Um, I'm not that far out. But if you guys are behind me, I'm next to you, but you can't see me on screen. No, I can see on fire, but I can't see anybody else. You've all disappeared. Yeah, I don't see you no more either. All right, I'm probably loading in uh, a million and one things. So what I'll do is I'm going to jump off servers from one to another. Okay, thank you. And then bring it back to west. Oh, that's 60 milliseconds. I'm gonna say that. Close the zoom. Okay, that ought to bump some people in there. Make sure that didn't turn off my engines. No, nope, all four engines are running fine. Thank you. Pretty epic music. I can only see. Uh, we can only see Trey and Sasa. All right. I can see it on fire again, but uh, that's still the only one I can see. It's flying down to 1300 knots. I'm going to have to bring this right back. There we go. Chunks come in. I have descended to your um, left. Yeah, I'm coming in. Okay, I'm going to get myself through from the chunk clouds. But I'm going to have to get down. Why is the audio and face cam so desynced? Sorry about that. Um. <coughs> I don't know if it's because I'm in Discord as well, or it's because uh, when I, my internet has a hiccup, the camera doesn't seem to keep up. So I will work on it, but I, I don't know at the moment. So apologies there. We've got some cloud. I'm already descending. I I am. Okay, cool. Oh, we're over Germany. You're over Germany? Where did you guys go? Well, maybe we're that's trying to refill. So he's trying to fuel me up right now. Right. Refuel. Uh, Thorgrim, I don't know, mate, about the camera. I'm hoping that uh, I can work it out. It may actually be something to do with Streamlabs. I might have to put in a new... Um, All right, uh, we should be coming in. ...latency or something. You're still at 480, Shano? How fast are you now? 488. All right, good. Should be coming in. LFPG. Actually, get in there, LFPG. Alright, thank you. Oh, 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 yep, yep, there. Charles of Gaulle, thank you. No, Charles of Gaulle. Thank you, there we go. 40 miles, I'm 40 miles out from Charles de Gaulle, everybody, letting you know. But I'm gonna ask for a uh, landing a lot further out this time. 26 right, okay, cool. Well, that's actually not too bad. And winds at eight knots, okay. I might actually be able to do this one just a little bit um, easier. There's Rebel Boy down there, I can see him now. All right, I'm coming. I should be coming up to you soon. If I slew, I'll go past you. That's the problem. So. Yeah, I know, but like. Okay, 600 knots. Won't bring this window down, but what I might do is I might just take this down even further. 
Speed out of 10,000, thank you, autopilot. VFR. I can't see anything because of this cloud, but it does look cool that I've gone under them. Alright, cool. And we have sat on zero throttle now since about 30,000 feet. Doing quite well. Alright. 28, wasn't it? 28. What's your current speed, Shano? Right. 26, right. 26. Okay. 480, alright. Coming in at 500. So Should be able to get some fuel. I'll do a slight right bank and. Okay, not maintaining enough to get a smooth streaming. Oh, okay, here we go. If it crashes, thank you everybody for joining me. Uh, coming into Paris often uh, absolutely tanks the frame rate. That in London. I'm going to go back to clear skies because I want to show off what it looks like here. So if my stream crashes or the internet crashes, it's because it's trying to load in the information at the same time. Alright, I'm at 500 knots. And... I'm going to take the window down. Thank you. Alright, yep, got the fuel. Thank you, thank you. Alright, now All let's right, just get the hell out of here. And slight bank. All right, I'm going down to 30,000 feet. Thank you, Shano. Right, 35. I'm going to run the gear down because I need to slow down. Brett, you're already on. Uh, are you on approach or you're already on final? I'm on approach. I'm just All right. I'm doing a uh, left bank and then a right bank to bleed off some more speed. Yeah. My uh, protective window is already down. All right, you're going to be waiting probably a good 20 minutes at yeah, Charles de Gaulle once uh, by the time me and Shano get there. It doesn't take long to uh, I'm going get in. I'm going flat out now. That's just because right, I want to... I need my throttle, thank you. Okay, I need to set my trim down. Is that uh, Chuck on final, was it? Okay. Where are you? Are you above me, are you? That was definitely a good short right Sorry there. Was right, was it? That, was, that was good looking, that was uh, Dre. Yeah, thanks. I'll have to watch that later. Yeah, I'm gonna have to, that's that's great short content there. I do have, yeah, that, that'd be cool. I do have some refuelers if people want to uh, muck around with them. Yeah, maybe we should do something like that. Ooh, 26 right? Holy smiley, look at all these. When you get Get too close to be able to see your disappear. Yeah. Yeah, that's a shame. I wish they didn't do that. I've actually overshot this. I'm at 239 knots, uh, 2800 feet. The sun is actually in Paris at the time. Right. Chuck, I can't see you though, Chuck. You were the one person I could see everywhere, and now I can't see you at all. I can see. I don't even see anybody anymore. None of, no one from our group. I okay. I'm, yeah, I'm with. Um, all right, I'm switching servers east. I think you're just miles behind Dre because I had to slow a good bit to catch him. So, yeah, maybe Brett is just that far away from me I can't see him, but... 200 nautical yeah, miles. Like, Beyond that, you don't show up. Yeah, maybe I'm that I far out. Why am I getting so much wind? We're, we're slowing sideways here. Turn Can you still, still I see that for a fair day? Yeah, I don't see anybody, so I guess everyone is just that far away from me. Yeah, I see. Game right. crashed. Got that overture. Game crashed. Well, that happens when you get uh, close to Paris. Yeah. Uh, now we bring it in. Thank you. That happened, I think, last week. But, oh, right, we didn't go to Paris last week. Well, 
I'm getting that wind again. Uh. I think they should have given me that uh, runway on the left there. This one's much shorter. I really would have liked the long one, thanks. Good time for uh, music like this. 27 right. Ah, uh, 27 right. Wrong, wrong, wrong runway. Oh, still seem like. So they've got 27s and 26s here. What is with it, Paris? I'm gonna have one degree out runways. I don't know which one I'm coming in on. This one right, I gotta watch your stream. Uh, reverses. Oh, but I didn't need them. Um, yeah, you know what? The longer runway was probably actually the one I was supposed to. And I think what happens is that they're one degree different to each other. So this one was the 26, and that one was the uh, 27 right. I know, I was getting across in there too. Okay, Okay, I see you guys now, so I'm coming. I'm, I've caught up to all of you, uh, except Brett. I don't see Brett. I see Shano. Oh, no, I do see Brett now. I see Jerry. I see Chuck. And I think I saw somebody I else. The, uh, so I've caught I've caught up to you guys. Fifteen hundred knots. This is my current speed. Keeps wanting to climb, but I reckon I ought to start descending. Okay, request to gates, thank you. But, uh, yeah, it was all right. It was all right. That one was probably the better one I did because I was going slower. But uh, it wasn't until I read 27R that I was like, are you kidding? All right, five viewers right, in here. Eight, Thank eight, you. Seven. Hey, good test order. You're in the Air France Concorde now. All oh, right. This is what happened with the uh, livery. 14 viewers. Welcome, guys. We are... Um, Right at the end of our uh, journey here, the um, 1996 Concorde tour to Charles de Gaulle. How did you just go through from there? I am not going to do a zigzag there. And in comes another one, <laughs> smack into the building. <laughs> Holy smoly! And he la lands right in my parking spot. Oops. I'll move. Yeah, this is not a bad parking spot. I can park it straight in that straight ahead there. Three All seven. three wheels stop. Oh, right before the uh, the uh, pushback tug. I only just missed that pushback tug. That's embarrassing. All right, and I'm going to shut down the engines this time. Uh, should see the uh, engines and temperatures going down. Uh, very cool. All right, welcome to Charles de Gaulle. So this is part one of a three-part series that we are going to do, uh, taking and redoing the uh, Concorde's uh, 1996 tour of. Well, where do we go? We went to London, London to Dublin, Dublin to Stockholm, Stockholm back to Paris, but Charles de Gaulle instead of Orly. Then we will go on next weekend, uh, same time, uh, from Charles de Gaulle. Where are we? Uh, we won't do the repeat again. We'll go from Charles de Gaulle to Beirut, Dubai, Jeddah, and then Cairo. And then the following week, we'll go Cairo, Milan, right, Madrid, Paris. All right, I'm 24 Charles miles Charles out Charles. of Charles de Gaulle. All right, what we'll do is do you see the cars in the middle part there? Yes, 
they, they very do powerful. like they do jumps over the the road there. All right, where is Dre? Can I see him? There he the is. Hover car. All right. All right, I got runway twenty six. All right. All right, let's go and watch one more Concorde come in. No pressure or anything, but you're going to be like terrible on camera. Um, <laughs> not expecting. Then we'll do a final photo because this is all part of a Pepsi tour, uh, promotional tour. Uh, I'm not affiliated with uh, Pepsi though. Uh, did we get a animated from my cough thing? I don't know. Redeem. Oh, I didn't see it actually come up. Brett, have you installed the Nimrod yet? No, I need to do that. N I've still got a whole bunch I haven't installed. All right, so while the other Concorde comes in, we've got our three Concords down here and a SR... Yeah, it doesn't matter. SR-71. No, I, I didn't see the cough animation come up. Why? Hmm. Okay. Maybe it's not All set right, up. 26 right is what I was given. Uh, sometimes it doesn't actually show up. Uh, it's amazing how we've been to what? Three different countries in less than three hours. And now we're back in France. Four. Right, yeah. France, for, yeah. UK, Ireland, Sweden. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't count. No, and Britain too, so that makes it five. Oh, we went over those, yeah, and I went over Norway by accident. Alright, how are you going with that uh, Concorde? You, you struggling to turn it around, or? I just gotta get lined up. I'm coming in, t I'm coming too fast, so I'm just gonna do some loops. Right, yep. Oh, yep, here come, here come the bad frames. Here they here come. Here we are. Well, okay. I... My drone, amazingly, can keep up. This is Dre flying his Concorde. And it's unfortunately, he's come over his plane Concorde. Oh, up oh, there it is. Wow, this is one fast drone. All right, we might need to just smack dab crash into the terminal somewhere, but if no, that's the situation... Just do a loop, <laughs> and I think 26... 26 no, right. That's what you know mean. what? Both of these are 27s. You want the one on the other side of the airport. It's 26s. So confusing. Which one did you guys... One one which, one did you, which one did you guys land at? Well, we went to the wrong one, so... All right. Do the same as us. Just go to 27. Yeah, I'm not... Yeah, I don't want to tax... I'm not going to spend half an hour taxiing here, so... Uh, yeah... Yeah, that would be. So 26 right is over here. It is one degree different to 27 over there. Just to be difficult. Game crashed. Oh, again? again? Uh -oh. Yeah. I'm gonna have to tell my drone another to 25 or something. I mean, I'm is getting. Charles de Gaulle a. Premium airport? Yes. Um, yeah, yeah, we learned that the hard way, you and me, when we flew yeah. from uh, Wait, Heathrow to though. here. We learned that the hard way. Yeah, I was Premium Deluxe. Dress premium Deluxe. Yeah, you took the Tupelo on that premium flight, deluxe. I took the 747 on that flight. Now, you both learned that from Heathrow to JFK, too, Dre. Right, yeah. Jerry's still bringing up the rear. JFK isn't that bad, though. Yeah, JFK is fine. I don't get how Charles School could be even worse. You landed. Well, the France update has well, to make things worse, no, because I'm sure they updated Charles yeah, de Gaulle. Your name's still up in the air. They did a bloody right. Netherlands, Luxembourg, Belgium, France. Why? I right, right beside, uh, on for... ah. I got your name way up in the air there. All right. I lost Thorgrim altogether. Dre's still working out where he's going to land. 
I know where I, I just gotta like I just gotta do a short the turn. On the left it's all the better ones, I think. Yeah, I know where. I know where uh, I'm going. I'm gonna be there. Yeah. All right, I'm just doing a really sharp turn. Harry's name to you, but it's floating in the air. I think my Harry internet. This is an AI F15. I don't know why it's just parked there. And it's missing a canopy. So I'd say something's mucked up. Well, thank you very much for the 11 people that hung around waiting for uh, the refueled Concord to land. Yeah, I gotta have gotten some good hours from this stream. Have a look at this building. Oh, isn't this fancy? What is this? Is this like walkways and stuff? Where does it go? Is this car park walkway? Is this a car park? It is too. Wow, that's a fancy car park, isn't it? I'm guessing they're tunnels that go into over here somewhere so you can get to the terminal. Right, so it's not just parking, it's actually terminal as well. Tell me when you're on final, Dre, and I'll come over and bring the camera in. Yeah. All is up. All the all this big middle parts of. Oh, okay. Interesting. And then they walk through the tunnels and whatever. Yeah, you could just walk yeah. right through the tunnel into the airport, Charles de Gaulle. Into the mini. Tunnel. All right. Now I need to work out where I'm. Yeah, so we're gonna have a short final. I'll give them the two pack a go because apparently it's got an improved uh, cockpit with all new custom gauges and stuff. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll. All right, I'm on final. I'm on final now. It's gonna be a short one. Okay, thank you. And then uh, I'll let you know. Might be uh, if it if it shows up like uh, the current one. Yeah, I guess we'll use that. All right, I'm just gonna have a slideshow really on my stream. It's just gonna be more of a Microsoft PowerPoint. I actually want to take a bunch of screenshots and then make it into a PowerPoint. <laughs> well, I mean, I get to experience that daily. Alright. No longer shows up Pepsi, but that's fine. Don't worry, you're gonna take a picture of it. Uh let's not put that music on just yet. Did you make that music? Oh, it's on the back. Or falling out of sky or something. Where's Captain yeah, you know, been uh the past couple of weeks? He has he's usually one of the regulars. been around. He's in here early this morning. I was having a chat with him. He's been playing uh, Star Wars uh, Battlefront 2. Alright. Are you going to land on he's going to land on the arrows or he's going to make it to the Oh, that was a okay. butter. It was off. Okay, well my, my stream showed your wings went through the ground, but that may just be a uh, glitch between your that's the uh, only thing you've done, apart from the ATR one. Because the ATR 72 cool. That was I rough. I love the get work was so good. That was a butter. Right. That was actually quite... Extremely late, so I'll say bye now. Yep, right, Luke. What we're going to do is I will finish it up here. Dre, do you want to just uh, I'll, I'll... slew yourself over into a picture and... Uh, sure, why not, if I can. Or, or taxi it over if you're able to. See where we are. Where are you guys? F104 in the game. F104. Okay, I see you guys. Yeah. Uh, I don't have one installed, but I do. All have right, it's probably the closest I can slew, uh, and I'll just taxi from here. Tim Skunk Works FSX one that they had. Jerry, see you, Luke. Yep. Where is where's Dre? 
I'm I'm coming over Here right now. Yep. Alright, that'd be four Concords. Wait. One being Pepsi on my picture. Wait. I know okay. Oh, I just hit something that was invisible. <laughs> Alright, so you're a I just see you as an Air France Concord. I don't see any Pepsis. Yeah, I think, no, that's just what's happened on now. So so Still we got so wall, you're in a Concord, Dash Auto's in a Concord, Twelfth is in a Concord. Orgrim. Oh. I just All right. I'm stuck in here. How do I? I can't. Yeah, okay, a, if I just slew, I go past right it. There. There's some. There's something I, I can't get past. I'm like stuck on yeah, it no, here. Slew yourself, I think. I can't. I if I you. slew, I slew past you guys. All right. Well, I'm actually going to end it there because we got everybody. I've taken a picture. Uh, this will be the promotion. So I'll end the music as well, and then um, look, we'll do the same next week. Tomorrow will be Beam and G. Uh, Beam and G multiplayer rock crawling and mucking around. Uh, that'll be. Uh, 21 hours from now, so uh, it's on my channel. It's already there, ready to go. But thank you very much, everybody, for joining me. Have a great night. Like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. If you're watching this in the future, uh, keep an eye out for part two and three, which should already be up, uh, unless you're watching it this week. So it'll be next weekend. Cheers. Bye bye. Bye bye. Getting up. All right. I am going to do my outro. I'll be right back soon. All right. This has been a great stream, everybody. We had a lot of fun things happen. Uh, for example, the midair refueling. Uh, if you're watching this stream now or after, please leave a fat like. But anyways, I guess that wraps up for the stream. Hope you guys enjoy the stream. Please subscribe if you guys want more streams like these. And have a good day.